Good evening, everybody. Is this thing working? Hello, hello. Test one, two, three, four. Ah, there we go. Got a, got a reaction. Welcome to, well, the ball. <laughs> the ball is some indie game I just uh, recently purchased and actually have no clue what it is about. I heard that it's uh, like a first person shooter with a ball. And yeah, I have never played it up to this point, so I guess it's basically a completely a blind run, so I don't have any idea what it is. Well, that kind of ball. Okay, let's see. Uh, controls, yeah, I got that. No, it's not about balls, it's about a ball. Oh. In... In the Aztecs, it seems. At least considering the names. Okay, Pehua. Introduction. Separate from your friend. Oh well, let's just start. Ball! There it is! Look at it! And look. The logo looks pretty crappy, I have to say. Oh god, this room will be so filled with puns. Mexico. Nine, 1940. Isn't that like uh that's close to World War One, uh, World War Two, then again, it doesn't really matter. Hey, that's Indiana Jones there. Balls in Mexico. Oh, it can't be a taco. Are you alright? That was quite a fall you took. I doubt I would survive Let's that if I really took that the fall. Crane broke down. We have to fly Mexican poles. It's not like I broke all my all my feet while I jumped uh, fell down there. Oh, my hat. I can't. Oh, is this one of these weird games which has jump on control? I never got that. Oh God, it's also one of these games where you where you moan every time you jump. <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, I guess the character's feet are made of me out of rubber or so. Come on, look at that. That's one fall you would have died again, but no. I don't mind. Press A. Oh, thank you. I sure need... Well, I guess I'm some sort of undead now. Considering the falls I'm taking here, it seems that he can't be really alive. Ooh, spear. Yeah, clipping spear. Hello, spear interior. Okay. Oh, that's the ball gun, I think. How the hell are you supposed to wield that? Just look. That thing looks heavy as hell. Okay. Left to use hammer. Okay. Right to. Okay. No idea what that does. Let's see what? What did it say? Blue. Hmm. Okay. I just. Stop. Oh. Oh. Okay. I have to probably hit that. Bonk. You know, I just couldn't hit it like normally after you use this weird contraption. Okay. This is good. That's one hell of a contraption. Also, there's light in this place. Okay, and I'm above this is the distance between me and my ball. Okay. Hmm. What is that? Button is for player. player oh. This button is for a player. Player is always blue. Walk onto the button to activate it. Hey, that's me! Well, fits. Looks exactly like me.
<laughs> this is so silly. Uh, that step counter is the distance between me and my ball. And the ball is apparently above me since I, if I jump, I get closer to it. Oh, can I bash in the light? Bonk. Bonk. No. Can I bash the oasis? Come on, what for a game is that if I, where I can't even break shit? Jeez. Half-Life Blue Shift was better there. At least I could break... Break... Break crates. Break crates. That's how the place looks. Balls to the face. Ah, look at... Look at that. If that isn't a ball. Hmm. Okay, remember it away. It's attracted to me. Hello there, pretty ball. Got it. Ooh. Okay. How do I make it that it follows me the whole time so I don't have to? Okay. Let's see. Ah, that's one big hell of a ball. Boom, and there it goes. Well, I guess I have balls of... I don't know, is that metal? I don't know. I just have a big ball. It's not of steel, but at least it's... big. Where's the player mountain? Okay, so I need to attract it over here, I suppose, so I can... That switch. Oh, look at that. I am making progress. And. Wait. Oh, okay. Hey, I solved this puzzle. Hooray. Uh, let's see. Point. I'm still very disappointed I can't break shit. Just look at that base. Okay. Uh, there we go. There we go. Do I have to be constantly sucking in order to have that in front of me? Because it gets kind of tiring. There's all the safe and we will spawn here. Respawn here. Beautiful. So, what do I get? Mankind took the ball from them. The source of their mysterious power. They taught man many things. How to build. How to tame the land and harness the seas. But when their children betrayed them, they guided man no longer. They <laughs> recoiled. Yes, I'm sucking balls. Oh, became God. became vengeful. Mankind prayed that they would never find... Hello, who are you? I hope you're not trying to kill me. What is... What is born? I want to know what for a fellow it is. Sup? How are you? Oh, it's a monkey! Hello, monkey. Monkey, monkey. Come here. I want to hammer you. Okay, he didn't like that in particular. Can I just roll him over? Oh, God! I <laughs> no, I will not suck the monkey. Jeez. I'll... Crush him with my ball. Okay. Okay, I can go through here. Bam. Come on. Whoa! Hey, my ball! Oh, um. Uh, Aztec magnet, it seems. When, since when did the Aztec have fucking magnets? Jeez, how do they work? Okay, let's see. Get on that, deactivate the magnet, and put the ball in there. There we go. Oh, that wasn't that hard, was it? Stupid magnet. Jeez. This game is, has just so many fucking puns, I can't even think think of which, which pun to do next. And again, I should. And again, that's a bad. Also, the man. 
Jeez. Uh, what do I need to do here? Oh, get on, get on the ball. There we go. I got on the ball. So now, yeah, that's a dead guy. Well, he's kind of undead. Ooh, that's nice. Press Q to make him. <laughs> That's beautiful. Yeah, maggots. Or bugs. Can't even roll over them. What the hell? That is so cheap. Look at that. That's just a sprite float coming out of nowhere. <laughs> that looks beautiful. Whee. Tasty bugs. Oh, I have to put the ball here. Oh, did I already? No, I think I... I'll just put the ball there. See what happens. Okay, I think I already put my ball there. Oh, oh I think it was a save point. Uh, wait, or oh, do I need to... Does this open the door or no need? Huh? Okay, now... Ah, it opens this, and now I can maybe push that in. Okay, that's an elevator, so... Okay, put the ball here. Put that down. Oh! I know. Suck it in. Hey, that's the Team Fortress sign. No, it's not a... It's not the companion cube, it's a companion... Ball. Okay, I have to stand on that. Whoosh. Area complete. Oh, I think I need to get over there. Oop. The hell is that? Hey, Mayan face. Can I club you? No, I just. Hmm. This is not mine, so there's this kind of way to have water on the ground for all of us. Because I'm in the Altipetal. More is water, barriers between the whole month was wasted. Well, whoop de fucking do. Bash. No, okay. Uh. So, can I just jump down? Yeah, I can. So, I guess I can go now through this door. Yes, I can. Bam. Whoa! <laughs> Hello there! That was kind of close. Oh. Yeah, that looks rather painful. Bam. Those spikes want to penetrate my balls, I think. These buttons are connected. Oh, fuck. Uh. Well, my ball just went down a pit, and there's a monkey again. Come here, monkey. Grr. Okay, I can't kill the monkey. Okay, the problem is my ball is down there. How do I get my ball back up? Hmm. Oh, there's there's stairs. I'm tripping balls here, guys. You know, I should make a I should make a I should make ball a bannable word in this chat. Okay, there we go. Okay. Oh, there's the monkey. Run, but you can't hide from my ball. Yuck. Wow. That's kind of nasty. I totally teabacked him to the extreme. Okay, let's see. Hmm. That are a truckload of spikes. So do I just have to shoot the ball over there? Guess so. Pow. Ah, the spikes are definitely lower. Uh, 
Sons of Nicholas. Ah. Uh, what the? Oh, these. There are these bugs again. This is such a low quality, low quality effect. Jeez. Ooh, lava. Uh, I guess I won't be stepping on that. So can I go some? Okay, I can cross that lock here. But I need my ball in order to continue. Uh, let's see. Oh, can oh, I can go through here? Still won't be stepping on that. Just in case it triggers something, like death. But I guess it's just more like a warning sign or something like that. Whoops. Now you look pretty dead to me, punk. Okay, he doesn't care. Yep, that's definitely lava. Oh, is the, is the ball lava resistant? Let's see. At least it looks like it. Oops. Fuck. Need to get my ball out of the out of the heat. There you go. And pow. There we go. Okay, that opened. Uh can't get that thing up here, so I'll just step on that. And what did it do exactly? Oh now I can drop my ball over here. It's like Marble Madness. It's actually not like Marble Madness at all. Ah, there we go. Wait, that was compl completely pointless. No, wait, it wasn't, because I couldn't get it through, the, through that log. Ugh. There we go. Me and my... Okay, I don't... Yeah, these things don't do anything. Then again, who would actually make trap, uh, make have trap doors with an obvious skull on it? There we go. And put the ball over there. Aha! Oh, hey, Swabby! Nice to see you here. Okay, let's see. No, I don't. <laughs> okay, let me see. What did I need to do? What? What did I do? Oh, I attached the ball to this weight. There we go. All the game is that what I have constantly in my face. It's a ball, and it's huge. Okay, simple enough. Oh, is that a... Oh, that's a... Hey, that's a companion cube. Oh, I can punch that thing. Okay, the Aztec Science Companion. Companion box. It's not a cube, it's a box. There we go. Well, that was simple enough. Oh, I need to put my ball over there. Pow. In there. Get in there. Wait, I think I don't need to do that. Fuck! Oh, wait. So, what did that do? It's a cup of this. Whoa! What are you doing, ball? That was probably a bad idea. Is that a giant fan? Looks like it. Whoa, wee! It's actually kind of fun. Look at me, it's a, look at me, I'm a pointless mechanic. Oh god. <laughs> Punch the cube. Or hammer it. If I had a hammer, I would hammer in the morning. Whoa. That's kind of weird. Yeah, there are enemies in this game, but it's a tutorial level, so they're first showing all the random mechanics. 
and then they're probably going to like introduce yeah evil balls which are trying to tea bat me no that's probably the main reason why I actually bought this game is because the screen just looked kind of cool because they were like a, a zombie okay maybe not the zombie gorilla but they were like the ra ra uh, run of the mill skeleton things and uh, these are people, I think, or something like that. Whatever. And pow. Get in there. Beautiful. And the same for the other side. And I guess there will be a run. Oh, come on. Get through there. What? There we go. Crazy fondue. Oh, yeah. Crazy fondue. Hey, there's, there's a cube. Whoa. That's interesting. Is that really how I was supposed to do it, or was that just... Oh well, fuck that shit. Brute Force! Ah, Brute Force! Okay, I think it... Yeah. Oh, fuck this shit. I punched it the wrong way. Uh, press C to crouch. Oh. Fuck, I punch it the wrong way. Ugh. Get through. There. You stupid cube. There we go. Ah. Eh. There we go. Get over here, you stupid cube. Or throw into the next lava, lava pit. There we go. And punch it over there. I hope there won't be a level where I, where I could use the, uh, lose the ball. Okay, let's see. Ah. Whoa! What's up with my ball? What the hell? <laughs> Give me my ball back! <laughs> it's like a punching bag. Okay, I guess that's the end of the level or so. We feel like a feel like a cat who's just playing with the. Whoa! What? What? Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm on top of the elevator now. Fine by me. Oh. Ow! Okay, fire hurts. I think I'm not supposed to be supposed to be up here. And it's kind of high. Uh Yeah. <laughs> uh is that water? I just hope it's water. Uh, phew, it's water. But my ball is still up there. Come back, come to me, ball. Oh I missed you so much. Okay, I don't want you anymore. Hey, you burnt my ball, you stupid fire. That's what she... Come to me, ball, that's what she said. That doesn't even make remotely sense. A boy and his ball, that makes sense. That's classy. Hey, achievement unlocked. Beginner's luck. Hey, I'm in Otstock 1. Where's my ball? Oh, I have my ball. I like that I have, like, a ball radar. Oh, the ball's behind me. There it is. Where's the ball? There it is. Where's the ball? There it is. Peekaboo. Kind of... Kind of dislike the skull constantly grinning at me. Oh, hey, monkey. Take aim... Pick a ball! Oh fuck, I missed it. Or did I? Where's the monkey? I'm sure there's like an achievement for killing every every single monkey in this game. It's a zombie monkey, he's just suffering. There he was again. Where are you? I have a ballsy present for you. Wait, that doesn't even make any sense. 
my attitude is ballsy, but it's not a ballsy present. Ah, uh, me and my ball, which... Ah. Uh, okay. You can go on Twitch now. Okay. Where's the... Is there a switch or so I need to activate? Uh, no, there is no switch. Yeah, the ball was humping the wall, that's what I realized as well. Oh. Mm. Uh, no help messages available. What about if you open the damn door? Open the door. I've gone. Oh, I've gone backwards. Seriously? <laughs> I'm so busy chasing monkeys that I've gone backwards. <laughs> oh, silly me. Oh, yeah, true. That's the gate with the penetrating. The way ahead is shut, entombed forever by the people of the Tallen Banner. You know what? That's actually an idea, Swalbot. Uh, let me actually. Uh, are you in Skype, Swabby? He who attempts to break the seal will make a wasteland of his home and those of his brothers. Okay, let me call you quick. Uh, let's see. Skype. Uh, Zbola Jones. You're not online. Jeez. Oh. No, up to this point, I only trusted members. Oh, you are. Let me actually call you and see if you if you're there. Dick balls. Dick balls. Big balls, yes. That's an interesting uh, greetings. Uh, how, does oh, thank it, you. how does it actually sound in the sound in the stream? I think I don't know. It seems kind of quiet, but uh, I got muted mute it anyway. So. And what about all the people saying? Uh, they all want into the, the fucking call. See, they're laughing about dick balls, so it's <laughs> fine. <laughs> I, uh, Oh, he's a little loud. Okay, then I'll quickly mute him a little bit. Yeah, sorry about that. Oh, you're always so shouty. Jeez. Yeah, I, I think it's because of all the Americans. <laughs> you always have to oversound them. Oh, hey, there's another monkey. Yeah, at least there's no annoying Dutch guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh? Oh, I think I... I just hit the monkey, I think. Jesus. So, uh... What is this game all about? Uh, it is. Don't, don't say balls. <laughs> well, it is. It is kind of like a. It's supposed. I think it's like a cross between a first-person shooter and. Yeah, I can see that. Portal. It's like you have this ball which you use to defend yourself and solve puzzles with. Hmm. And that's pretty much it. I just. I bought it from the from the potato sack because it was actually like I think nine bucks <clears> or so. Ah, uh, so it's got some conspiracy shit in it, I guess. Conspiracy shit. Yeah, haven't you heard about it? Like they hide portal stuff in all the potato sack games. They they do. I I, I was actually yeah. I was kind of weirded out with this whole uh, portal two and potato sack crossover stuff. Yeah, in all the potato sack games, you find potatoes, and somehow that has some sort of uh, like I don't know. If you play the games and stuff and do stuff in them, you like make portal two get released early or something. I've heard about that. It's like I've already have someone in my friend that's found like ten potatoes. Yeah, there's a pretty huge thread about it on SA. They're just going crazy over it. Oh god! It's even got its own Wikipedia thing. <laughs> okay, I'm underwater. So no. interesting. <laughs> you know, a oh. game with a ball, I would expect that I have no water elements, but no. Well, it's made out of metal, so. Let me see. It might sink. I didn't actually try putting it in water, but I just yeah, have saw that. Beautiful. It looks just like <clears> me. Then again, I have no cl no clue what my guy actually looks like. You know that burn production goes up when you keep your balls cool, and water is a good coolant. <laughs> True. Oh, I drank the water. 
just realized that. But this guy can just take so high falls. Just look at that ledge. He just jumps down. Yeah, I, I noticed. Not like when you jump on. from the elevator. Well, okay, I fell into water. Shit, I, my ball is still up there. Ugh. There we go. I'm good at ball sucking, it seems. Spider Man. I don't think he's Spider Man. He hasn't been climbing up any walls. I'm about to say, he's not. I'm still waiting for the first enemies. I thought this game is actually pretty heavy on enemies, but no. Yeah, maybe it's like Alien vs Predator. <laughs> Suddenly gets spooked by something. Ah! No! Everything's drown- No, I'm drowning. What the fuck? Okay, that's why I hate Aztec Temples. You pull a switch and shit is happening you should didn't, which you don't expect. Have you ever been in one? Uh, no, actually not. Ah. Well, I've seen them being documented in games, and I think games are a pretty accurate uh, media. Yeah, there was, uh, I remember a game from the late 90s, I think. Something like Montezuma's Revenge, but it was a first person shooter that but it was pretty obviously a rip off of uh, Indiana Jones. That game was pretty, pretty bad. But it had all kinds of traps. So it was basically first person, Prince of Persia kind of thing. Yeah. You know, I actually realized the, the, the drawback of a call now because I have to now. To tri ah, box. Triple task. Juta Jazz is calling you, by the way. Uh, I'm not. I'm not pretty. I think I'm not going to put anyone in this call. No, I mean he's he's he just wants you to answer him. Oh. I know yeah. he just said coach, 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 and. Coach, coach. Yeah, I'm sorry. I think I'm going to leave it with one uh, caller now, just to see. Whoa, that are a lot of arrows. Oh yeah, he wanted to be. No. Sorry guys, I've got exclusive rights. It's... <laughs> you have VIP access. Exactly. Yeah. Always give it to the crazy German. <laughs> you can do nothing but dick jokes all day. Well, well, then you're kind of lost because we're in a game about balls. Oh, well, you can't have dicks without balls, really. Then again, here are many errors which can penetrate me. Oh, you do it. Okay, I guess that's just. I mean, yeah, then I guess you gotta put the ball in front of the arrows or in front of yourself, and then. There's another monkey, Jesus. Maybe you can use the monkey as a shield. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if Peter would appreciate that. Then again, I've been rolling it over with, bat with balls the whole time. Yeah, also, our uh, shade X, my accent is German. Shit. I think. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep. I know someone asked. <clears throat> I'm gonna keep uh, answering stuff for you because you're obviously. Oh, you're my you secretary. No, shit, I need the ball. Wait, I don't need the ball. <clears throat> I'm just gonna put it over there. That's not that you're doing a secretarian job for me. Yeah. No, when was uh, the last time. I was doing stuff with you, like trying, I think. Yeah, that was. It's, what, <clears throat> that was great. Too quiet. I can even jump in water. What the fuck? That's <laughs> like Matt. Why can't I jump in water? Or at least this is like a little jumping animation. <clears throat> hey, apparently, due to Jazz as a girl, so you m might want to add her and make tit jokes, I guess. <laughs> um, <clears throat> maybe he's just lying to get into the call. Oh, uh, that's possible. Still, you can still make tit jokes about guys, anyway. True. Great, my Also, uh, <clears throat> there's a question, uh, what is your favorite thing about Germany? I don't know if he's asking me or you, so I guess you go first. Ooh, favorite thing about Germany? You know, if I say Stefan Raab, people will probably hate me. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, I kind of respect him for all the, uh, all the music stuff he does. Yeah, I, I'm, I don't ex uh, really find him a great comedian, or at least not anymore, but he... He contributed a lot of things. Mm. He does. I mean, <clears throat> I don't know. He's been around for a while, and he owns a whole channel now. So. Yep. And he, I think he even extended his uh, thing now. His uh, contract with Pros even. Mm -mm. Oh, at least, can we talk about Germany once, at least, without mentioning Hitler? Thanks. <laughs> but he was such a big part of Germany. He was, yeah, but still. It's a different Germany. Also, he was Austrian. That makes it even worse. <clears throat> again, if you don't, if you talk about America, you also don't constantly talk about Charles Manson. Yeah. <clears throat> well, I mean, he was just one <laughs> of many people to kill a lot of guys in America. Yeah, it's just the only one that popped into my mind. 
Or the Boston, yeah. Boston Strangler. Wait. Yeah, Boston is in America. <laughs> I was quickly thinking is, if it, yeah. If it, yeah, I was about to say, isn't that in England? No, wait, it isn't. And someone asks if you're ever gonna play Risen. Risen? Or, or Gothic 3.5, I guess. Or was it Gothic 4? Uh, no, Goth the real Gothic 4 is Arcania. Ah, yeah. The best <clears throat> game ever. Well, it's a Gothic 3.5 then. Yeah. It's a Gothic <clears throat> ripoff. I'm sorry, Joe Wood knows how to, how to make the real Gothic games. Uh, yeah, we've seen that with the, the third one, I guess. I've actually been considering playing Risen, or either either doing a stream, or maybe actually doing a Let's Play of the Gothic 2, but uh, that's still a long way. Mm -hmm. Also, uh, Judah Jazz is waiting for a final answer. Final <coughs> answer to what? To the call thing? Yes. Uh, no. <laughs> Just make it quick and painless. My apologies, but uh, I have ra I have I had bad uh, I had bad experience with random randomly inviting people into calls. Ah, bugs again. <clears throat> Me too. Like, <clears throat> remember those uh, like nine people, ten people calls we had in the past? Uh, no. Oh, I'm back on LPF. Oh, so we yeah. We just randomly put people into calls. Like Tiber. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah. Oh man, Tiber. We should track him down and add him. No. <laughs> Let me see you do. You get right on that. Okay, I don't need that cube, I guess. Fine, I'll just continue on. Okay, I'm a little bit lost without my ball, I have to say. It's like I feel a bit, a little bit naked. Okay, let's see if he's actually... Yeah. He's not online, but he might be invisible. <laughs> I'm... I think I'm missing the balls to go alone. That's too bad. It's not an awful show. Jeez, every every ball-related choke in this stream is is terrible. Well, of course. I mean, you're playing a game called the ball. Oh God, that's an elevator, and it's leading me somewhere. Okay. They should make a game called the cock, and you would have to, you know, uh, that's a chicken and uh, or a rooster. I should say, you should, you know, you have to. <laughs> un you should have to shoot him with a gun and, and solve puzzles. Yeah, like also, Nero. Are you asking me who I am? Uh, yeah, he's, um, that's, that's a guy I'm playing League of Legends with a lot. And of course he doesn't know you, so he's ah. a little bit suspicious. I'm a ghost. <laughs> I'm a ghost. He will haunt your ass, bitch. Oh, it's fine. I mean, I'm a goon, I'm, I'm used to it. <laughs> used to being not trusted, or? Yep. <laughs> Okay, I mean, you've, you've seen me play games. True. Okay, maybe I actually need to put that fucking ball. Yeah, Naron, let me just say I'm not I'm not a stranger to code. We've known each other for like three years, four years now. So... Don't worry about it. Okay, that's... What is that? Is that a tar pit? Uh, okay. So, it must be a time port or something. Oh. Okay, I can jump in it. What is it? I don't know. Well, okay. it, it looks like tar. Am I actually sinking? No, I'm not sinking in it. Okay, well, it... Oh, it, yeah. I can't... It, oh, it, I can't jump it, in it. It's spooging all over the floor now. Ah. Oh, yes, it's... Oh! Da, 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 da. Okay. Maybe should have considered that this could... might happen. Uh, ah! Ah, it's on fire now, okay. Now I get it. Yeah, I was on fire as well. Okay, now I get it. I have to waltz that in the whatever the burnable thing, burnable stuff, ignite it, and then roll it to the to that rope over there. Ah! Yeah, great, great balls of fire! Isn't that a Little Richard song, or was it Cat Stevens? Uh, you know that I'm not a really connoisseur of I, of music. Yeah, yeah I know. Of class, unless, unless the... I, I wasn't asking you anyway. <laughs> you were asking my... Whoa, I just... Yeah, real good. Also, I think it is Great Balls of Fire, not Big Balls of Fire. Okay. Oh, can I, like, have it in the air? Because I think I'm... the problem is that I'm... Ah, I ignited it again. Oh. Ah, now... Oh, now I get it. I have to first finish, uh, finish the thing, the... the trail, and then ignite it. Now I get it. Well, obviously. Actually, you're right. It's actually pretty obvious, but 
Then again, you, you probably haven't seen me play in the Amnesia. I would have liked to see that. <laughs> Let's just summarize it by I couldn't count uh, to eight with Roman numbers. Oh, yeah, that's. <laughs> yeah. Oh, an exploding ball. And people are asking you to stream music in the background. Stream music? Yes. Uh, you know, I'm actually one of these paranoid people who don't like to play their music because they always think it's incredibly uh, awkward. Mm. It's like, no, not that track, not that track. <clears throat> well, if you let me handle the music, <laughs> nobody's gonna know it anyway. Gonna edit you what? The music? Yeah, nobody's gonna, you know, know the music. Nobody knows Khan or Amandu or Tsvai or... Oh, if you if you do the music. Yeah, if, if I do it. Then they'll probably instantly ask you to stop playing the music. <laughs> oh, that's not fair. Well, you're too underground, I'm sorry. I have great understanding of art. Oh, but... Okay, I shouldn't say most of my viewers don't, because <laughs> that's a little bit insulting. So, I didn't say that. Didn't say what? I didn't listen. Uh, me neither. I've, oh, I, I, didn't, I actually didn't say anything, it just, it just... Oh, there's cockroaches all over your screen. I know, it, I've, Amnesia did that already too, it's kind of annoying. Maybe the guy should watch some more. Himself, that is. Also, Judah Jazz, you're welcome, I'm, I'm good at phonetics, so... Yeah. Okay, that's... what the hell is that for a uh, ball? of Stella, hmm. Or Stella. <laughs> is this going to be like a... Arch talk now. So if I'm gonna try and avoid it. <laughs> because otherwise I'm going to feel very, very stupid. Oh, ah, and I Yeah, I remember our argument about it. Also, Tyba is not answering me. Thank you, oh. yes, my accent is pretty sweet. <laughs> I love Battle it. Stella Band. So, what did He's I an Austrian, so I don't like him already. <laughs> okay, open this gate here. Put the ball in there. Oh, hey, minecart. Okay, randomly crashing minecarts. Get away, ball. Yeah, I'm agreeing with the white lion. Never attempt to learn well. Oh, there's an enemy. Ah, uh, protect me, ball. Oh, there are several enemies. Oh, by the way, by the way, there's a great question that hasn't been asked before. I bet. Um, do you have any favorite LPs or any you look up to, except for me? <laughs> Are you actually doing any LPs? I remember that you like. No, no, no. <laughs> Hell no. I remember that you tried to do once and then you just gave up because the editing was frustrating you. Yeah, I'm too cool for LPs now, so. Then again, I have to say I've also became really snobby with LP, uh, LP choices because I'm mainly only watching. Oh, they're evading my ball. Shit. <laughs> ah, where's my ball? I am at. Okay, there we go. Uh, Let me finish your sentence here. You mostly watch them on SA now. Yeah, I, <laughs> I, I've actually barely any YouTube uh, LPs anymore. Because probably behold my strength is someone I really like to watch. Yeah, I've heard of him. Uh, then again, Frank Matic is SA as well. Yep. Well, nowadays he is. Uh, wasn't he the whole time? Uh, no, no, he did stuff on YouTube and then we did registered on SA. It's probably the best thing if people just ask me opinions of LPers because I can't really think of any currently. Or just of my favorites. I just say stuff generally on SA. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> I mean, they just have, you know, the quality stuff, the standards. Exactly. Like, not saying that, that YouTube stuff is generally bad. I mean, you're doing your stuff on YouTube, for example. But, um,. But I just like having standards. I was about to say, SA has quality stuff, like tipping 40s. <coughs> hey, uh, Juta Jazz is asking if you can join your next broadcast. <laughs> uh, phew. I've got, I've, got a, I've got a great idea, just, uh, you know, send him like 50 private messages on YouTube, that might work. <laughs> you know, the problem is if I let someone random join, everyone is going to ask, that's a problem. Yeah, I know. So, you have to, yeah, like... That there's a lot of bootlegging onto until, until you're like gone. <laughs> also, some people are complaining about lag on the stream. Um, I guess my, my, my the, the best suggestion would be to refresh it. Yeah, I think the because it, I think it's 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 really smooth for me, so I'm not having any problems. And I'm also talking to him, which might you know 
make lag a little bit more of a possibility. Then you can have a 54 megabit, you know, uh, bandwidth. But yeah, I think the problem is that I'm streaming like in basically HD quality. Um, yeah, you are. And if people have a rather weak connection, it might start to lag. So yep. I guess that's the main problem. I already f thought about like reducing the quality, but I've been too lazy up to this point. <laughs> Even though it's quicker, a little setting actually. Mm. Okay, where do I actually need to go? I have to put my balls somewhere, but. It's less baggy than a Call of Duty game, someone says. <laughs> I think the only laggy Call of Duty game I've played was World at War. Yeah, World of War was terrible, I remember that. Yeah, especially since I'm in fucking Germany. And like half the game is missing, and I can't play the zombie co op mode or co op in general. What was that? Was that cut? Was that all? Yeah, it was. It was. That's why we couldn't play together because I had the German version. Oh, true. Yep. Oh, the, oh! I tried to actually also tried to cope with another German guy, but he couldn't either. So that's probably the reason. Yeah, uh, Felix Firefox. It doesn't have Nazi zombies for Germans, and that is a travesty and a crime against mankind. Oh wow! They're f firing fireballs, and I finally know where the fuck I need to go. Just need to find my ball now. <clears throat> well, just you know, just look down. Hey guys. Oh, I can't just roll, roll them over like that. that would be too so, easy. you basically got the gravity gun from Half-Life 2, I guess. Basically, and I'm running a big ball around. That's basically the whole mechanic. It's like having really like then again there, you know, there isn't anything like like a ball shaped thing Half-Life 2. It's like uh, the Ravenholm chapter, just that you have like one weapon per man. <clears throat> Aren't there those uh, energy balls and then the Citadel or whatever it's called? I mean, I've never played Half-Life 2 or Half-Life 1, so I wouldn't know. Uh, what was the question? What about those en energy balls? Well, you have to use energy balls in that big honking tower in Half-Life 2 to solve puzzles, I think. Uh, well, this puzzle was basically just uh, breaks shit with it. Basically, pick a pick a ball up and then shoot into a random generator. So, balls. <laughs> well, it's a small ball and it's made of energy. Okay, I think I'm just gonna run for it. And yes, apparently girls have gravity guns in their crotch. Okay, I can't break that. Where do I need to go now? Where do I need to place that thing then? Torn, I've never played a single Half-Life game, and I also don't like Portal. Shame <laughs> on you. Oh, I see. Oh, fuck you. You don't like Mass Effect. Well, because I dislike ma uh, science fiction. I think it's a good game, but I'm just, I just dislike it because it's science fiction. See, I don't like. See, I don't like Half Life because I don't like Half Life. <laughs> but it's great. You have to play it. Ugh. Need... Yeah, white line. Uh, Germany has huge problems with uh, people being set on fire or execution scenes, or like Nazi symbolism. It's getting better though, and there's like three different government agencies that handle censoring, and it just depends on like who the the game gets or who the game is controlled by. Okay. Yeah, uh, Manhunt was never released in Germany. And again, it wasn't Manhunt was probably just because of the content. Well, it wasn't even like yeah. brutal per se. It was just because you're strangling people with a fucking plastic bag. Yeah, I th I th it's always about like how it is uh, shown. Like for example, in Crisis, I can still pick people up. <laughs> oh, I've seen that so many times in a Maxwell stream and um, freelance astronaut stream. Yeah, I don't watch those anymore. Not? Nah. I'm not a big fan of those LP groups. They're just always the same. Yeah. Then again, I've just. They're just good for killing boredom because it's it's just mainly they're playing stuff and you can watch it. There's nothing like fancy about it. No. Also, Coach uh, Juta Jazz is asking how much bootlicking we're talking about. <laughs> uh, that amount of gold you're seeing right now, that's the amount of bootlicking. <laughs> is that even gold? Don't you already earn more than there is in the game right now on the screen? <laughs> I'm a simple word. I'm a, si a simple word, man. I don't earn that much. Uh, I know how much you earn. That's. Did I actually tell you that once? You told me that, yes. 
You you even converted it into euros for me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> was it like a? I think I was like trying to brag or whatever. Hey, I'm on my ball. Look at that. What happens if I suck it? Oh, it's doing the Borderlands thing. They just oh no, you don't bounce around. Yeah. Never mind. <laughs> Whoa, that's actually. I hope they're not trying. Uh, not thinking that I have to do it. I see come there's a stage where I have to place on my stand on my ball and just juggle it over a spike pick while I'm standing on it. <laughs> oh, probably. Also, why don't you try Borderlands? <laughs> uh, Borderlands. I mean, recording. Well, Borderlands is boring alone. Oh. Oh, it, it is. It was, it was a reference to, you know. Ah. <laughs> well, we tried out more than enough. <clears throat> no, yes, we did. Well, you did. Yeah. Remember how did how many times did we start that? I think five times at least. True. And then then in, in the end we all got angry at each other again. Oh yes. Because that's how that's how co-op games with Coach and me work. By the way, we just play for an hour and then get angry and stop talking to each other for like a week. <laughs> oh, there's another magnet. Of course, is that it's historically correct that the Aztec had Aztecs had uh, magnets, no. right? I'm pretty sure they didn't. But they were very advanced. No, there's not. There's another magnet. What the fuck? Are you gonna get the potatoes, by the way? Someone's uh, asking Jeff Finnegan. I have. I guess, I guess he's Irish. Let's see. Ah. <laughs> okay. I just got bald. Well, I'm tr Ow. if I find a potato, then I'll potato, uh, then I get it. But it's not like I'm going searching every every little place here. Yeah. Uh, Torn, my name is Robot Jones, um, and Dragon Age is a pretty awesome game, except for the glitches. Should I go forward and say that I dislike Dragon Age, so people can uh, yell yeah. at me again? Yeah, Coach Ma doesn't like Dragon Age because it's got a lot of dialogue. That's why he also doesn't like Never Winter Nights. No, it's because I don't. I like RPGs where I can actually do more than click on the things I want to kill. Yeah, a uh, coach. Uh, someone's asking what genres of games you play most or enjoy playing most. I'll spy I'm gonna let you answer that, I guess. Uh, phew. Currently, I'm just mainly playing FPS games or uh, also. What you Mario's. I'm. It's been a. It's been such a long time since I actually played a platformer. Then again. Uh, Okay, you can call Super Meat Boy a platform, and then again, it's yeah. one of those masochistic ones. I, th <clears throat> I think I did that wrong, or did I? No, I can just put the ball over there. Uh, let's see, I play, F like I said, FPS, uh, RPGs. Then again, it's been a while since I've played a decent RPG lately. No, 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 wait, Fallout New Vegas, duh. Yeah, that's an RPG. And, and an FPS, so. And I have over 100 hours of it. So, uh, let me check how many hours I have. I didn't. I just got to New Vegas and stopped playing uh, because of Man of War Assault Squad, which is a bitchin' game. Yeah, I played 19 hours of New Vegas so far. Yeah, I've been like I've played now like through three different. Uh, I played two characters up to this point and got three different endings, and now I'm going for the final ending. Mm. Then again, the problem it, it like what I realized again what why why. Fallout 3 was so uh, discouraging after a while is that if you get to the max level just everything becomes bleh. Yeah, I never I never understood that about uh, uh, Bethesda's you know <clears throat> leveling mechanic. Then again, it's just that you probably don't become too strong or so, but it's still... Yeah, but if the game gets harder because you, you know, advance your character, I don't know, it doesn't make sense, I think. Yeah. Hey, the, the the concept is interesting. It just it's just kind of flawed in that way. Then again, uh, New Vegas actually had uh, th isn't actually into these uh, leveling enemies. It's actually there are like areas where there are just two strong enemies where you just can't pass through. Mm. Oh wow, that's a beautiful lava scenery. I'm gonna look better, Metroid Prime. Well, I haven't played that yet. I haven't played that. It's good. Also, a uh, shy guy wants you to say something in German because he or she is, or I guess he's a guy, um, is German as well, apparently. Well, ger German. I remember that. German, German, or Swiss German. What, they're Swiss German? <laughs> yeah. Kreis of Hondi. Kottigan. Oh, shut up. Ja, ja, that. No, no, that's, that's that, actually Kölsch. That is Jölsch, Junge. The Bubba Cop. 
I'm from the pot, I wouldn't know. <laughs> I saw somebody yes. asking for hot girls in here. And why in I'm this... I'm pretty sure he got paid by Juta Jazz. Still haven't said anything in German yet. He's is Neron or Neron or German as well. Yeah. He's yeah, I figured as much because he's, he's complaining about your uh, about your code. Yeah, he's he's the guy I play League of Legends with quite a lot or the whole oh. time actually. Still play that? Yep, I'm so I'm playing that like like two or uh, two two uh, two game uh, two games per day. So I'm playing it still fairly uh, often. Also, why am I in a fucking card? Did Aztecs also have like mine working mine cards? No. <laughs> I'm going to ask you that every time. I know, and I will always say no. And that's that's actually something they had. I was about to say, did Aztec have raffle gods which uh, demanded sacrifices? Well, basically. Apparently, half your viewers are German or Austrian. <laughs> Seems so. Because Tron wants in. And since he included Austrian, I, I'm gonna guess he's Austrian. <laughs> Just look at my ball going nuts. Oh, so White Lion keeps asking about what you're gonna stream next. <laughs> oh, due to Jess's Lithuanian. Great. A Lithuanian oh. girl. Lithuanian dad. No, wait. No, mom. <laughs> mom, yeah. Jeez, my ball. Calm down, calm down. I mean, it's Bavarian, that's almost worse than Austrian. <laughs> but what's with people, what's with Germans hating Bavaria? It's like always. Because they hate us! <laughs> like every time it's, it's about Bavaria, people say no, that doesn't belong to Germany. Well, it doesn't. You know, Freistaat and all that. It's <clears> like also, it's... they're the con. No, I, I might suck a cock at some point during the evening, Tom, thank you. Um. No, I don't know, they're that just conservative, for the most part. But they have Edmund Stoiber. Well, he's retired. Yeah, yeah, it's actually been a while since I've seen him. Then again, it's like, not like I'm really into... No, my ball! My ball! My beautiful ball! Well, it seems... Well, I've... I guess you lost it. I still can't break those vases, jeez. That's ticking me off. Yeah. Also, I'm, I don't really hate Bavaria, Tawn, don't worry about it. Um, <clears throat> I've been there a couple times, it's a nice place. Uh, the Oktoberfest? <laughs> no. <clears throat> no, I, I never want to go to the Oktoberfest. I was about to say, you're not the type of guy who goes there. Yeah, I just, I prefer drinking in my, you know, own region. Ah, there's a, ah, <clears throat> there's a current. No, my ball. My Welcome ball. Oh, Minecraft. What? People tell me to play Minecraft or what? No, it's just the current and not being able to, you know, go against it. That's like a Minecraft. Oh, thing. don't tell me that you're playing Minecraft. <clears throat> you know, I'm playing Minecraft. Sometimes it's just a boring game. Okay, I was about to say you're probably not, hopefully not one of these people who spent the whole day building cocks out of uh, gold or whatever. I did once. <laughs> of course. And then, I, and then I put a bed in, in, you know, in the top and <clears throat> basically made it my home. <laughs> I'm living in a giant cock. I'm living in a cock, suckers. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <clears throat> that's beautiful. Okay, that also that's a village. Interesting. Apparently, someone made a Yahtzee reference. Uh, I did because the golden cock. Yeah, the golden cock. That's. Oh. It. It, I don't know. Do we actually watch the zero punctuations? Not anymore. Not anymore. Oh, there's an enemy. Yeah, like that last time Yahtzee uh, <clears throat> posted on SA, he got a hissy fit because everybody was like, Oh man, you're Yahtzee from Zero Punch Rage. And... He actually is, he's <clears throat> actually still active on. Then again, I... <clears throat> uh, yeah, someone did an LP of his uh, adventure games. Oh, yeah. Then again, he also did, did an LP himself. I didn't actually know that. Ow. Yeah, uh, flashback, was it? Uh, I think so. Yeah, but I know he he's just so full of shit actually that I don't really want to watch his stuff anymore. Well, I don't really know him. Then again, it's also not that I watch him because I watch his stuff because I love him, just because he I just watch his stuff because it's actually it's actually quite quite good fun. Yeah, I know it is. I know. Um, also, due to Jess, I don't think I can convince Code 
<laughs> I've, he's one of the few guys I've never been able to convince to anything. Oh, come on. Uh, you convinced me into buying, like, more, uh, more and more for 20. Oh, 40, yeah. 40 fucking bucks. Oh, and Titan Quest. <laughs> and, and... And Diablo 2. And, and Warband. <laughs> And Warband, yes. yes. <laughs> yeah, I could never convince him to do anything. You convinced him like, into spending two, like 100 euros at least. If not more. As I said, I know how much you earn. Then again, that's true. Yeah, but um, like, that's what my one specialty. I, I know how to convince people to buy stuff. Uh, oh, Sacred, yeah, I remember. You convinced me into buying Sacred? No, I didn't, but someone mentioned Sacred, and I'm just having nice flashbacks. I hate sacred. <laughs> Love Tromio's sacred LP. Oh yeah. Even though I only watched like four episodes because we were in them. Indeed. Also the what was that? Oh, yeah, the furry fruit juice. There we go. Remember that? Do the jazz. Just just stop it. It's a sacred one. I I didn't even know there was a second part. Well, it's still as terrible as the first game. Oh, I bet. I bet. Still the same Diablo ripoff. <clears throat> hey, you've got a horse, but get, guess what? We've got wizards that can just, you know, stop you dead in your tracks. Every time you gotta traverse the whole fucking map. Uh, the, you know, the first thing about Sacred is that I've started it like five times and I still finished it because I just thought, fuck that shit. I bought it, so I'm going to fucking finish it. <clears throat> what, Sacred? Yep. Well, I I don't know. I got to like to like the second act, and then I just teleported myself to the boss. <laughs> I got lost. That's how I beat. That's how I beat Sacred. I remember that the last boss was a real, real wimp. I was so disappointed. Then again, that's what just what the whole game was to me, anyways. Uh. Okay, some. I guess Felix Firefox is a scientist. Let's see. Where the hell? Oh, see. Shy guy wants you to do, to do, uh, turn down the quality. Uh, can't do that right now. It's like I need to. Stay. I'll, I'll do it for the next stream. I promise. I'm gonna turn what are you gonna? The... What are you gonna play then? Uh, I don't. I probably can't finish the ball in one sitting, so I guess the ball. Oh boy. I know. It's like balls of fun. Okay, that doesn't even. Ooh, some uh, Naron is suggesting Narim. Oh, I need him. Narim. I've already I, did. I already did a great uh, video gameplay compilation. Yeah, I've game. seen that, but you know, I think it's a good oh. mod. <clears throat> I've played it myself, and you know how I am with like Oblivion. I can never play more than like fifty minutes. Uh, yeah. And, and that's generous. I probably, uh, I probably would like it as well if I give it an actual chance. But you know me, I'm always yeah. take a look at it and then like, uh, no, it's shit, but. Like one of the always prejudiced. Yeah, like one of the single games which which I really gave, uh really convinced me after a long time of tediousness was The Witcher. Oh, also apparently we have furries in the chat. What furries in the what? In the chat. In the chat. <laughs> yeah. So furries have invaded this chat. Beautiful. Yep. Wish I still had the link to that commercial. <laughs> Well, it's just it's a how is this thing called, called again? Orangino. Yeah, something that some French. That's actually been sold that's up. actually been sold in Switzerland. Funny enough. <clears throat> oh boy. That's where where the fuck do I need to go? I can place my ball in here and drag this card, or I can probably place. Wait, I can't place my ball in there because there's a rock in front of it. People want to see Oblivion. No, I'm not <laughs> going to play Oblivion. It's just a game that lets you make a spell that's uh, that, that lets you create a spell which makes you basically invincible. It's just a terrible game. Which sure also lets you create spells that trash the game. <laughs> also, also the, I think the worst thing about it's just uh, I think it's it's a little bit hypocritical, but a game where the difficulty modifiers a fucking slider is also just terrible. No. Yeah. Well, Baldur's Gate did it. Well. Like I said, then again, no, hey, 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 I never, okay, I never, I just said that, I, I never played it, actually. Yeah, sh shut your mouth about Baldur's Gate before you say anything wrong. <laughs> okay, I will, ah! Because it's fucking, that's like, Black Isle Entertainment. Who made Fallout? Uh, never, never played the uh, Black Isle Studios, not Black Isle Entertainment. 
Oh, I've never what? played the classical, uh, the uh -huh. Yeah, you know me. It has yeah. too much text. Yeah. Then again, I've played Morrowind, so that had, that had tons of text too, and I still played through it. Ooh. I never did, I think. Well, I don't... I tried a couple times, and then nowadays it looks so ugly that I have to use the, the graphical enhancement mod, but that makes my computer lag a lot. <laughs> so it's like a vicious cycle. You can't, yeah. You just can't play it. You uninstall the mod, then you see how ugly the game is. Oh god. Oh, I would just play a Morrowind in like four years, I guess. Uh, okay. And you, sh someone wants you to go back to more retro platformers. Retro platformers. I could, like the Mario's. I could, I could actually like play stream a hack again. Like, is that, am I? What's that? Oh, oh, ROM hack. Oh god. Yeah, ROM hack. Like second reality project. <clears throat> like, I've, I've actually been like twitching to play one against it's been so long. Mm. Also people want to know your opinion about Skyrim. Skyrim is actually I'm actually really looking forward to this because uh, what I've read from it it's it basically fixes everything of, uh, they cocked up in oblivion. Because they taking a big chunk f from what they learned or what as believe what Obsidian showed them in Fallout New Vegas and put it <clears> into <throat> Skyrim. Yeah but I'm pretty disillusioned because I'm a fan of the Total War series. Um, so if some if a company says we fixed this and that, I don't believe it anymore without seeing it. Yeah, me too. I mean, who the hell is that guy? Okay, he's just stepping. Yeah. And Peter just wants to know your opinion. Uh, wants to know your plans after Gothic Two. Uh, well, my plans are. That are my plans. In other words, there are no plans. What's the deal with that? Oh, you're gonna you're gonna stop LPing? No, I just don't know yet. It's like, <laughs> I mean, you know my maybe you've witnessed how my speed my speed of Gothic Two was up to this point, and you probably know how long it will take. No, certainly not yeah. Gothic Three. Uh oh, <clears throat> yeah, Gothic Three is a, p a broken piece of shit, even with the community patches. Okay, why does my ball have spikes now? What's the deal with that guy? Deal with it. So if I step on it again, cool. Okay. So you just saved your ball again. I know it's full of spikes again. And what do I do now? I think if I get too close to it, I get impelled by those arrows. And shy guy is talking backwards now. Please don't impale. Only the stream is still lagging. Well, I've noticed it. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that's green water. Okay. Uh, oh great, they're enemies, and I don't have any weapons. So the green water is not death water, I guess. Nope, it's just uh -huh. Okay, so someone wants you to LP Silent Hill. Viewers! There was a ball here. It's <laughs> yep. gone now. Well, what do I do? It's like, can I like launch these spikes so I can... Yeah, well, I wouldn't do it if you're standing like, right next to the wall. But... Yeah, maybe there's like a staircase, like an elevator or a staircase I can take up there to, you know, to flip that switch. But the problem is I can't get up there. Seems at least. Hey, did you try Gothic 3 plus 1.74 and Content Mod 2.2, QP 4.2 German? <laughs> uh, I've actually never played, uh, played Gothic 3 with any community patches. <clears throat> uh, Tony is not going to do Knights of the Old Republic. He hates science fiction and the game has a lot of dialogue as well. Oh! Ow! Okay, now I don't want I think that was correct, right? Uh, okay, I the guy running after me. They're, okay, they're, they actually died all of the... Uh, okay, I'm just going to run for it. Uh, <clears throat> so what's your opinion on Star Wars? Uh, it's science fiction. So there we go. I've never watched any Star Wars movie. I'm never going to. Yeah, you're always so prejudiced. No, I just don't dislike it. Okay, I'm pretty going. Well, I don't like Nazis. I still watch war movies. <laughs> well, it's not that they make... Okay, they do, do make them. I'm also not a big fan of murder. <laughs> well, the problem is that every fucking media has murder in it. At least... Oh, oh yeah, I forgot Star Wars a science fantasy. 
Well, it's still Star Wars. It's still pew 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 and lasers and space and spaceships and stuff. What about uh, World of Warcraft? <laughs> uh, never played it. Never going to play it. Good. Then again, I've uh, what? What? I jumped down the shaft and I, again, unharmed. But you, I didn't even see a ball going down there. I'm paying uh, too much attention to the chat. The mag he was on the magnet, then he fell through there, of course, automatically. Uh, then again, I have actually plans on picking up Guild Wars 2. <laughs> what, uh. what does that sighing mean, or that sound mean you're doing? <clears throat> I don't have an opinion on Guild Wars 2. So, it's like... That's what it means. Like, I was, I was gonna try and find something to say about it, but... Oh, there's a monkey again. But yeah, Guild Wars 1, bitching game. Yeah, so I'm not sure if Guild Wars 2 is not going to be any good. It would be like a really the first MMORPG I would really play, would play extensively. I'm pretty sure it's going to be instance again though, and no monthly fee, so it's not, <clears throat> like, especially the instance part, it, it's not going to be a real MMORPG because, it, you know, there's no kill stealing people. Yeah, I, I'm certainly not going to, like, uh, buy it if it's, like, mon monthly fee, sh fuck that shit. <laughs> no, it's not gonna. It's not gonna have one. Okay, that looks like a scale. So if I put the ball on the other one, the other one... On one, the other one will rise, I suppose. Are you sure, Nero? Not that many instances? That would be a shame, because I like that. Okay. Oh, damn. That's the problem that I can't get up here. <clears throat> Great. Is there anywhere a cube I can steal or so? No, there's no cube. I don't want to play Guild Wars, but that's a puppies around me. <laughs> oh, okay, I know what to do. I need to place the ball on this platform here. Jump over there while making stupid groaning sounds. Why is that? Why do games still do that? It was it was silly also in like the Quake games or any other game. Oh fuck! <clears throat> I pu pulled my ball too much. Also, Rice Cake or Reese Cake or whatever is asking if you ever do multiplayer games on your stream. Uh, I thought about doing League of Legends, but the problem is currently I have the lazy solution that I just play all my games I stream in window mode, and League of Legends is kind of. Well, you should for a stream so I can pay attention to the chat. Yeah, I've also like... th thought about as alternative I just uh, plug in my lap, uh, plug in my laptop and open the chat in there. <clears throat> oh, you could have me, and I, I would just complain about League of Legends all the time, but I could also, you know, tell you what people are saying in the chat. Didn't you just stop playing League of Legends because you just got sick of it and not because you didn't like it? Well, yeah, but that's like... That I, I got sick of it implies I kind of don't like it anymore. Um, Duda Jess asks us, both of us, what we think about how games are made these days. Like, for example, the Fallout series. How... how... how are Yeah, you? I was gonna say specify, but... Um, yeah, do to jazz. Uh, specify your question. <laughs> Please, if you if you would be <clears> so kind, and I have no idea what actually unlocked. Jeez. Yeah, ne never wants to play it all. Yeah, I'm sorry. I've already played around with you. No, did I? No, I didn't. I played a ra I played a, a ranked game, and it was really fucking weird. Because the problem was that I just started playing ranked games, so I was on the verge of Elo Hell, and all the players were mildly ret mildly retarded, except me. What in lol? Yes. Yeah, it sounds familiar. Well, I I'm actually I actually reached a stage where people I mainly play normal games, so the atmosphere is mostly just chill, but still like uh, people think still a little bit about tactics and etc. <clears throat> so you barely meet any complete blockheads. Yeah, I just I don't know. I just played it for the griefing and left for fun. <laughs> That's so mean of you. Do I actually need to? Yeah, what? Jeez. <laughs> Do I actually need to get down here, or where the hell do I need to go? I've pl I I've put that switch there, but nothing opened. Uh, oh, real god, uh, I see. The Guild Wars 2 is not out yet, so don't worry about it. It doesn't even have a release date, as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, I think, uh, 2012. Oh, now I s ah, now I see it. Wait, but then I... Wait a minute, how do I actually use that? Ekron, Ekron, what's Ekron? Akron? A C H R O N. Akron? I only know Archon. Akron does is nothing. It doesn't ring a bell. Yeah, same. 
Okay, think, I think I got it. Now what I need to do, I need to crack that thing onto the platform. RTS with time oh. travel. So I think the switch does... Okay. I have to get the ball <clears> up there somehow, but I have to, like, launch it. Yeah. Also, I'm gonna look up Akron because it's apparently an RTS. A meta time strategy game. It's like a really old game. Okay, I'm kind of stuck. Let me see. What, what is help again? C? No, that's crouch. E? Huh? Oh, F! F is for... Uh. Okay, Juta just uh what is about what about F? Sorry. F focuses instantly on the ball. That's so stupid. That's uh -huh. weird. Also Juta just specified like uh apparently the differences between old RPGs and new RPGs like Fallout One and Two and Fallout Three. Or um also Counter Strike Source for some reason. Which I don't think is an RPG. <laughs> But it probably has some weird RPG mod, I suppose. Okay. And okay. um, next to I, I didn't read the Wikipedia article. I just went straight to the website. Okay. Help. H. Position the ball to next on one scale to opposite scale. Attract the ball and one. Yeah, that's what I did. It did. Ch I was up there. I got that Akron game doesn't look all that good. Reminds me a little bit of Nero or Nero. Yeah, oh, wait. That was a pretty great game, by the way. Just. uh... <clears throat> It was a game where uh, basically you did a lot of training stuff with the little bots that were just uh, basically <clears throat> uh, evolving AI. You would tell them to go around a wall, and um, some would make it, some wouldn't, and those that made it would be influencing the next generation of bots. So you would like have a constant learning um, process for your units. Then you could save them and use them in multiplayer and stuff. Don't worry, I'm quickly reading that. I've read it. Next to the level and jump down again and finally place the ball in the wooden bars while standing under the ball. Oh! Why? Of course! Why not? I know that's kind of high, but still, I'm trying it. That's kind of stupid. I thought that this is like some sort of catapulting mechanism, but I just have to do that. Uh, Nixito, you're definitely correct, but if I, if you look at the game like Man of War or Man of War Sword Squad, for example, that's basically an indie game because it's a small-time German developer. Um, but it still looks great, just because they went to the effort of making it look good. Then again, then again a small amount of people doesn't really already imply that it's an indie game. I mean, Piranha Bytes are only 20 people as well, and they don't call themselves... They don't make indie games, or they don't... At least they're not... Yeah, that's I'm, 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 I just mean uh, companies without a lot of financial backing. Yeah. Or without a big publisher behind them. I am going down the water. I, f I really hope this game doesn't have like any f su any su kind of suffocation or so. Also, Coach, I, do I hope you don't mind the RTS talk. Uh, no. Because yeah, I, you're not a big RTS p person, I think. Did you just say gracias? Gracias! No, I didn't. Unas cantadas días. Dos a veces grande, por favor. You just ordered a big beer, right? No, two big beer. Please. Yeah, dos. Wait, what was that about counting earlier? Huh, what did I do? Oh, hey, my card. Okay, there's old games, uh, I'm, I'm quoting due to jazz here. <clears throat> there's old games like Gothic 1 and 2, Fallout 1 and 2, Counter Strike 1.6, which I, I never played, Arcanum, Age of Empires 1 and 2, or oh God. Yeah, don't mention Age of Empires 1, Coach Mar. Warcraft 1 to 3, Starcraft 1, and so on. Oh, and okay. then there's new games like CSS, Gothic 3, uh, 3 to 4, Fallout 3, and others. And Gothic 4 doesn't exist. Oh, yeah. So I mean, now we still need the question that's just a, a list of games. I love. Oh yeah, I love Age of Empires 2, or I've just been a while since I've, or ages since I've played it. Yeah, we'll never play it against you. <laughs> it's like the, the, the one RTS you like, I'm not gonna play it against you. Just because I played it, like, yeah, I want to be professional for a while. Oh, ah. Call of Duty, okay, someone apparently made a mistake on the floor. Oh. Hmm, okay, well, what to do here? Okay, there is a stream of water, there is a 
that switch. I can press. I sh How the heck do I get to that switch? <clears throat> okay, I, I think due to Jazz's question is something like, what do we think of uh, the different production values that go into games and um, the different premise that they are made on or ba made based on? Uh, I'm drowning again. Just saying. So, so I think basically how gaming has changed what we think of that. Hmm. I like. I don't think I can say it's like there. To say it really generally, there are like two types of game makers: people who make a game because they won't really want to like give a unique experience. Oh mm. no 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 no! There was a head. I want the head. Get on the one. And the second type is just people who want to ring money. Yeah. Like games nowadays are for me usually too short and often too multiplayer focused. Ah oh, fuck. Yeah, it's. Like, I, I think a perfect example is Bioshock 2. Because yep. it's a game that, you know, it is, isn't is bad uh, as a game, it has decent gameplay, but it's just the problem is that it just basically sh uh, shat on everything, uh, shat on everything Bioshock 1 made great. Yeah. Um, like, also, like they, yeah, uh, like yeah they, go on. Like, they added ran uh Pointless multiplayer, which wasn't needed at all. Then there was, was a, yeah. there oh. was multiplayer in Bioshock 2. I know it's no. ah shit. Oh god, I was close. Sorry for the random shouting, but I'll no, it's fine. I'm used pushed to pushed into lava. And I think the main thing is also that I just take took a big shit on the story because it's what made what the, they made, what made Bioshock great. Mm. I mean, there's like um, especially there's just it's there's just so many plot holes the thing the thing starts actually with the villain that is uh, Sophia Lamb she's like supposed to be the big uh she was the big antagonist was supposed to be the big antagonist of uh, uh Andrew Ryan but the joke is that in the first game there was already uh, Fontaine as the big antagonist so she so he had basically two antagonists which doesn't make any sense in addition there's also the problem that uh she was never mentioned in the first game so it's it kind of doesn't make any oh, sense. Yeah. It's like she's completely irrelevant, but you don't. It's. Uh, yeah, I think you get the point. I get the point. Yes. Um. But like, I think. I know there's no more love in the game. <laughs> in the gaming world, like you've got some companies like Bioware who just try to make an awesome experience, um, and put a lot of money into it. Like, the, the, the games are fairly long, they have a lot of detail in them, and overall, they just give you a great experience. Um, then you've got Mafia 2, which is, in my opinion, a really great game, and has a, an amazing atmosphere, especially a game set in the 1940s and 50s of the United States, being made by a Czech developer. Um, I've never seen a game that detailed, like Mafia 2. So but it's really short. I finished it in 14 hours, and that is with a lot of screwing around and finding playboys. Oh, there's a... That's where I need to place the ball. There we go. So I guess my point is, uh, <clears throat> where's the love, you know? Yeah, you know, it's actually that... That's what I actually meant. But main reason why I don't play Bioware games is just that they're too fucking large. Like, when I played the Dragon Age, uh... The Dragon, the first, the Dragon Age tutorial, and I finish it like after two hours. And I just thought, you know, uh, <coughs> this whole thing another for another like forty hours. Uh, I don't think so. But you play New Vegas. Yeah, but th that's the problem. That you you can choose how long you want to have the game, you can, or you can choose it better because there's like the main story where you really have uh, you can say you can go to New Vegas, or you can just screw around and uh, explore the whole place. It just doesn't feel like so, uh, you know, it doesn't push you as, like, I think what Dragon Age would do. Mm. <clears throat> I don't know, I, I just get lost in uh, the newer Fallout games. Same with the new Elder Scrolls games. Um, people are also asking you to either play Lands of Lore games. Oh god, I have no clue about <laughs> these games. They're I've... basically like the, the old Might and Magic games. Yeah, I, I've seen... How is that guy called again? Kikowski or something? Oh Play yeah, Kikowski. That was a cool guy. He's actually... Isn't he still around? I have no idea. Uh, I haven't exactly been keeping up with YouTube people. Yeah, from me two neither. That's years ago. I haven't... Uh, like I said, I haven't played his, any of his games for ages. Oh, there's my ball. 
Yeah, also some white line asks you to play a modern online FPS like Call of Duty, Medal of Honor, or God, Battlefield, or Left 4 Dead, or others. Left 4 Dead, oh god. Hmm. And apparently Kikoski are still around. Someone says. I suppose so. Oh, what do I need to do exactly? Oh, I need to... Ah, I need to like... Also, apparently you have a hammer. Uh, there are magnet hammers here, I suppose, or... Oh yeah, yeah, I have a hammer thing in my in my my gun, but it's doesn't do me any any good against this. You're supposed guy. to hit him in the head with it. What? You're supposed oh. to smack him with it. That actually works. At least he gets knocked back, but he doesn't like die. Someone wants to add you on the Xbox. <laughs> uh, which I don't have. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what the fuck? This is just silly. <laughs> in the head, dude. Not not just in the crotch. Uh, I'm juggling him now. Don't forget they all want your ball because I don't have any. Ow! I take damage because he steps on me. I know you have to charge it. Oh. Really? Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, let him step on you some more. Damn. No, he's still alive. Okay, maybe I have to charge <clears throat> hard enough. Oh yeah, he gets knocked down. But he gets instantly up again, so it's entirely pointless. Oh, that, that is a great song, by the way. If I had a hammer? No, I, I get knocked down, but I get up again. Yeah. <laughs> that doesn't ring a bell. Really? Oh God, Jesus. Okay, there we go. I almost have. This the Holy God. Ghost. Holy Spirit, I guess. Yeah. Okay, now I think I have my ball back soon. This is kind of. At least it's just one single random enemy ch chasing me around. Come out, come at me, bro. There, concussion. It's like he doesn't <clears> even <throat> care. I knock him in the head. He's like, Bleh, I don't care. Yeah, yeah but it's a pretty cool song. Yeah, just just keep smacking him. Uh, I'll, I'll play a different game. You want to, you want to sing this song to me? Nah, don't, dude, don't make me sing. I do have the feeling if I step on that, it will collapse and we'll all will fall again, very, very deep. Oh, what's our choice of music? Ah, I knew it. How how deep I'm falling again? Ow. And my ball smacks me in the head. Uh, my choice of music. I've already yes. answered that in the Amnesia <clears throat> stream, G. Uh, hope mainly medieval rock or medieval metal. Yeah, that's fitting. Or, um, what should I call it? <clears throat> folk. Folk. Exactly, folk. folk. That's mainly my style of choice. And I have also some quite weird bands like I don't know, Pendulum or Peter Fox. Peter Fox? Yes, Peter Fox, I know. <laughs> you mean Seed, Peter Fox? Uh, no, not Seed, Peter Fox. Peter Fox, Peter Fox. But he was from Seed. Yes, but it's not Seed, Seed themselves, it's just his solo, his solo album was actually pretty nice. Naron asks if you listen to Fiddler's Green. Uh, it doesn't ring a bell. Then I can have... No, wait, it, you, you should, I, I, as far as I remember, it's a fairly good band, uh, for your genre. Uh, yeah, I've... I don't know, I'm, I think I'm also like a little bit picky, it's just sometimes I like, I mean I like uh, Corby Kalani, but I don't like Finn or so, it's just always like... Oh, Finn Troll is great, dude. I know, it's always like it's such like a... like one of the few oh, hey, fans of that drama that I just do. That's Steam. I hate Steam. Oh, it's Steam that pushes me up. Whee! Oh, oh, that's a... I love that. Do you, have you ever seen Watership Down? Uh... It's a tech I asks. That, uh, isn't that that cartoon with the bunnies? Rabbits. Or rabbits. Hairs. Yeah. Uh, no, never seen that. He asked me that in the last stream already, <clears throat> jeez. You should, that's it, uh, Kovishma. Absolutely serious here, you should watch the movie and read the book. <laughs> Why? And I'm not making a joke about your reading habits. I'm just saying, read the book because it's great and the movie is awesome as well. Watership Down is one of my favorite books and movies of all time. I don't think I should keep knocking on those pillows because the, uh, the floor might collapse on me. Maybe you should be knocking on heaven's door. Oh well. Okay, of course. It just perfectly falls. That makes sense. The pillars, of course, perfectly stand still even before I knock the shit out of them. Yeah, what I've done is also very disturbing, so you might like it. <laughs> well, I'm going to, sooner or later, going to watch the human centipede. So I think I've got enough st disturbingness. <laughs> Don't ask me why I'm going to watch it because I just 
Sorry, I just heard the tile again and was like, you know, I could actually watch it because it has some uh, trash horror potential. Mm. I mean, it's about, of course, a crazy German doctor who wants to put people together into a giant. Yeah, center. because all German doctors are crazy. Yes, of course. I mean, also all cannibals are Germans. Well, it's, it's been an established fact. Yeah, uh, due to this, I don't have any videos on my YouTube channel because I think LPing is gay. <laughs> No, I just, I don't know, my videos sucked, so I deleted them. And it was like three years ago, so I'm, no, I'm not gonna put them back up. Let's play goblins! That was fangromatic. You play goblins too? No, I didn't. You did? D dude, I played like three games, I know what I did. I remember that you played. I played Indiana Jones Super Great Adventure. I remember that you played goblins. Or goblins. I've played it, but I didn't LP it. Odd. Okay, maybe. Or maybe I. I'm mistaking you for someone else. Yeah, Frank Medic. No, I'm sure it he, wasn't Frank. He did, though. He did. Uh, Pretty sure it's on the LP archives. Okay, then it's probably not on his YouTube channel. Yeah, no, yeah he put it on Vidla. I don't know, dude. <laughs> Pretty sure he put it on Vidla or Oblip. Right, I don't know what to do and no help is available. I like that. I can't get through here. Yeah, okay, I guess nobody's interested in my music taste. <laughs> well, didn't you already say your music taste of music? Not really. Oh, didn't go this way yet. Uh, ball, could you come? Because there's zombies running at me. Oh, uh, Juta Jazz is getting sleepy because I think it is uh, half past ten in Lithuania. So he's getting what? He is getting sleepy. Oh. Um, and yes, I, d I listen to jazz, progressive, some kinds of metal. Blues. A lot of indie rock like the Pixies and Dover and you know, that oh. kind of stuff. Crowd rock, especially. Uh, a guy that were just people dropping. I like how they're actually smart in trying to evade my ball. Like they're running backwards out of the sun if I come rolling at them. But then he just got bald. Mm. Uh, I check Park of Stella out later. I don't know that. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, you don't get it, it seems. Oh, yeah, you don't watch it. I, I, I know the song. You know this? Is that actually a really real song? Or is it just. I thought it was yeah. made up by some furish, furish guy in a stream <clears throat> playing Bolian. Wait, it's still a song. I'm Bolian, I'm an anime. <laughs> You're an anime. Okay, you don't. No, I don't know it, but I I, I know the tune. So. Odd. Oh, Hammerfall, yes. Hammerfall is great. No, I hate... Oh, the, I kind of... The problem with, problem with Hammerfall is that it's, like, so silly epic that it, that I got sick yes. of it after a while. <clears throat> you should, Coach, you should uh, listen to the Grail Knights. <laughs> the Grail, ni Grail Knights uh, wear super, uh, Superman costumes in different colors. On, on stage, and they make epic music. Oh, hooray, rotating platform And their videos action. are so bad. Uh, oh, ah, no, 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 no. <laughs> now, Juta just asks if you're gonna update, upload the stream on YouTube. Yes, I do, like every time, every time. Uh, Mato SVK, uh, Grail Knights. Oh god, no, 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 oh, that's gonna hurt. Did, did you answer that <laughs> question? <by> the <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> He takes no falling damage. Did you just Thank see God. how f how far far I fell? Yeah, I did. I he, did. He didn't give a toss about it. Um, but yeah, are you going to put it on YouTube? I guess not. Yes, I can. Yes, I'm going. Whoa, where's right. where, where the hell did my ball come from? Yes, I'm going to put it on YouTube. Okay, let's try that again. Oh, and that's it. I'm going to put it on YouTube. Good night. Okay. That's with, what are you talking about, Grail Knights? Yes, Grail Knights. I was talking about them. They wear Superman costumes in different colors. Like Lordy. Just even more silly. 
Well, the Oddy is trying to look like, I don't know, zombies or something, or demons, but More the Grail Knights look like Superman. Okay, what am I exactly supposed to do here? I need to, like, get past this, uh... Probably... Can you crouch? Well, I did crouch, but it didn't help because it's a little bit too low. Can you jump on that thing? I could actually try that. Let's yeah, you see. should. And if I fall, it doesn't matter since I just can jump over. Hey, can, I, can I put uh, links to YouTube videos in the chat? Uh, I think the links are going to be removed because you're... Uh, okay. well, I'm not going to do it then. Uh, the time in my country is half past nine. When, well, I think it's the same for you, Coach. Uh, yeah, because we're not that far away from each other. Okay, let me see what the help button says. Press C to crouch. Okay, links are disabled. Once the buy one was activated. Okay, I can actually crouch underneath. Are you serious? That doesn't look crouchable. It is fucking crouchable. What the fuck? There was barely any. Sp it actually reminds me of, like uh, Super Mario 64. Oh yeah, it's 8:30. In the where I'm in the toy machine, I have to f I have to jump on the ants. The toy machine. Yeah. Luckily, uh, too bad I didn't have a teleport to get it back oh, up no, again. No, no. Wow. Teleport. Teleport. I think it's six, five or six p.m. in East Coast time, Eastern Standard. <clears throat> Oh, okay, I must... I know all the time zones. I was almost worried that I have to really walk on the ball now while walking on lava. Whoa! I'm walking on lava. Okay, that was actually... Walking on lava was possible in Gothic 1, but then again... I've got someone from Denmark watching. Awesome. Oh, I have multicultural, uh... Multicultural people. I love Denmark. It's a great place. Been there five times so far, I think. Uh, you know, Denmark is one of these places that... I don't really give a toss about because I just simply don't know it. Not that I don't care about it. It's just I don't know it. <sighs> well, I'm 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 at least like honest. You sh you know you should spend some of your millions of your Schweizer Franken and go to Denmark for once. Well, what is there to see? The Atomium? No, just great countryside. Denmark is is beautiful. They've got an Arab here as well. They got awesome. what? An Arab. Oh, an Arab. Ah! Ah! Yeah. <laughs> I was on my ball. Just saying. And since I'm close to a deadly lava pit, that means something. I will just go this way and see what's there. Uh, Neron uh, M Mannequin Piss is in Belgium, not the Little Mermaid. The Little. Or, or Manet Manetje? I, I don't speak that, <laughs> which isn't even language. Beautiful first person platform, platform without feet. That's always pleasant. Yep. And every time he jumps, uh, at least he doesn't even like do the manly grunt, which. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I'm a little bit crispy. Oh, thanks, Juta. Apparently, my, my accent sounds British. <laughs> you know that some someone said that to me too, and I was like, you know, this is kind of insulting for all British people. It's kind of insulting for me. Why, Brit <laughs> I don't like Great Britain. But I like the I like the accent. They, they still have an obsolete government. Okay. Why first person platforming without feet? Okay. By the way, to any British guys and uh, watching it. When I say I don't like Great Britain, it's like as if I say I don't like Austria or Switzerland. It's just mostly joking. You don't like Switzerland? Well, your country is pretty conservative, isn't it? What are you still doing in my call? Well, I don't know. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> well, that broke the ice. So I pressed the switch. So what am I going to do now? See, some people don't can't take a joke. I can't. They, th they think I hate Britain. I'm too neutral to actually consider something as a joke. That doesn't actually make any sense at all, but oh well. Uh, Juta, I don't know enough about Lithuania, to be honest, to have an opinion about it. I know it was a pretty huge country a couple of centuries ago. 
before I got snatched up by Poland. The only thing I like about Lithuania, Lithuania is it's our Lithuanian. Is Lithuanian? I know. <laughs> oh come on! I wanted to do like a joke. Then again, probably nobody understands it except me and you. Yeah. You want to do a joke? I want to prevent your joke. No help. Why is there always the same thing? No help message available. Gee. Are you sure you're just going in circles? The problem is I I don't know what I triggered with that one switch. If I still need to be here or if I need to be somewhere else. It's, wait, White Lion says... Uh, he, he thought you sounded a bit English when he first heard you, but it's because he doesn't know anyone Swedish except you. What? Swedish? Think, yeah. Oh, oh, I understand. That people can't... What, what, what's so hard between... The, the distinction between Sweden and Switzerland? <clears throat> Yeah, what's, what's, you know, one country has 50% income tax, one country has no income tax. Oh, that has, that has a lot of <laughs> sucking range, I just realized that. I can suck a lot with that ball. Okay, I think I, there's probably some other like switch I can, I can press with, activate with that ball. If only there's another blue thingy thing on the other side of the lava pit. Uh, which... Well, I was already on that... I'll reactivate it. that one. Oh, and the Lithuanian president apparently has a third belt in karate, which makes him a dictator, I think. <laughs> you don't oppose me, I'll kick you. Wait, I, I stepped on that thing. Oh, there we go. What? Oh. Why is that... What's the point of that moving? Okay, whatever. Sweden is the best country in the world. White line. And blonde girls. Oh, blonde girls. I'm more of a red hat guy. I actually like red hats as well. Tennyson. And again, it's like, oh, whatever. I'm living with one, so. Oh, I'm living not. Thank you for reminding me of that. Oh, sorry, me. sorry. Oh, great, I, ha I already have to put that ball there. Only Neron is a red hat, but I think he's a guy, isn't he? Uh, yeah, and I'm not yeah. that much into gay sex. I'm not I've never tried it, but I don't know. <laughs> like, not... I, I can't have an opinion on it because I never tried. I'm not that desperate yet, thank you. Ask me in five years again. <laughs> I think it's gonna be that long. Okay, now I get it. Mr. Tech guy asked if you can still if you can still give you tips for Paper Mario. I think I haven't even finished any, any everything in there. There was like a, a, lot, a couple of fruit there. I just thought, what the fuck, <coughs> what is that all about? Hmm? Uh, yeah, he can give spoilers. I don't care. It's not like I still have that game. Yeah, yeah it just just start spoiling then, I guess. Um, I just no, realized that people are talking about boobs now. I just realized that Naren has a point. What he's saying. Yeah, Soba Jones. Soba Jones is the other guy. Where I am talking about balls, Grindy. Well done again, there. Well, women have balls as well, and <coughs> yeah, forty thousand or four hundred thousand. I'm not sure. To about. a certain extent, I should actually like try and realize what I actually activated before a back before a backtrack. Because I'm pretty sure I actually activated something on this side of in this room somewhere. Hmm. I have not seen enough of that room yet. There we go. There we go. A gate opened. I can actually suck. Oh, I can't suck my ball through there. Maybe I don't need to bring my ball along. <clears throat> From what I know, you need like you need to miss like two ribs to be able to do that. Ah, oh, there we go. There's a switch. Oh, what's your opinion of ninjas? Pirates are better. Hard but better. Can I just be lazy? No, I can't. But actually, with the with how pirate piracy is nowadays, I wouldn't say that. Uh. Oh, hey there, guy. Let me suck me. Let me suck you. Wait, that's a bad idea. Uh. Do I just need to drop down here? Okay, let's just drop down here. <coughs> Cutscene. Okay, also, everybody's gonna hate me, but I'm gonna say that cowboys are better than ninjas and pirates. Why cowboys? Because they're cool, dude. They just, you know, they come up and say, 
Hey, what's up, stranger? And then they shoot you. Uh, hooray, I'm falling down yet another pit. And they wear sweet hats. And trench coats, or dust coats. Jesus maybe. Christ, that pit is large! What the fuck? And again, I don't take any damage. I feel like You're three kilometers. really far away from your ball, by the way. Yeah, I felt like three kilometers, if I can trust that. Uh, if that's like, uh, actual... M no, I don't think meter, that are meters. Hey, fish. It might be miles. No. Or yards. Maybe it's yards or feet. I I'm pretty sure it's feet. With the, uh, speed is increasing. Yeah, hey. it's gotta be. Hey, I got an achievement. Hooray. And I'm underwater, and I have a ball. My ball is back again. See, it never leaves me. I said I would like to drain this place because I hate water levels. <laughs> You're still doing the tutorial, someone else. Mankind built the cities of I just hope this game doesn't have any water in it. Because that's 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 actually what the the more the hell with the water uh, water levels start just suck. Until the caretaker mm. the plane. Like what Half Life did the whole and time so of these fucking Oh yeah, you never played Half Life. Yeah, I never played Half Life. I don't intend to either. But there's Squen Co op. We could play it together. <laughs> yeah, I know. We can play Gary's mod. Uh, Gary's mod is so tedious. It's like you ha actually have to do stuff. You have to like think some. Actually, have to, like to think about what you want to do. So what's to do with those fucking underground cities in this? Oh, place? I can just make a huge cube, strap some you know jet engines to it, and drop it on people. <laughs> that was so much fun. <laughs> well, it gets all off, right? Hey, fish. Can yeah, I, I remember that the little boat fight uh, Soapy and I had. <laughs> oh yeah. Hey, that fish doesn't even care. Oh now it starts to care. And hammer you, bitch. Someone is asking for your age. Um, 50. I know that's a lie. <laughs> it's like... Yeah, also they know when you were born, so... Don't I... What I was about to say, don't... I have it obviously in my name how old I am. Because I was too lazy to think of a unique name, so I just put my... Put a random number in at the end. Yeah, I'm so glad I didn't do it. Well, you also had Swobot Jones for, for some weird microphone thing on the set, uh, ZDF. Whoa, what, what is no, that? No, not ZDF. That was fucking Vivart's role. Okay. <laughs> yeah, which doesn't exist anymore and it makes me really sad. I was about to say Vivart's role? What, what was the deal with that? I mean, there was the regular Viva, which was just... Yeah, but uh, Viva, Viva 2 was um, basically Viva, but with more alternative music. Oh, so it was... It was basically a dream of me come true. Uh, it's like uh, well, it was like twelve years at the time. Channel for rock snobs. Not rock snobs, just like people who don't just want to listen to Marilyn Manson and shit like that. Also, someone asked what 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 interesting things there are to watch in Germany. I don't know what you mean if it's like TV or actual sites like architecture. The dome. The dome and girl. Oh, I broke something. And someone isn't really happy about that, it seems. Oh, I'm trapped. What the fuck? Yeah, the beautiful people of Germany. Well, doesn't. Oh, great! Hooray! Uh, it's battle of survival, it seems. I'm just going to. I'm just going to camp the corner. Fuck you guys. I like that polarization you cast with your little song there. What? The laws of the golden... the dome and Yes, the s someone says stop it, another guy is just, you know, saying then da you heard the hin, but... You know, it's, it's actually kind of cheap what I'm doing here. <laughs> just look at the taunting it's, it's like Left 4 Dead. <laughs> yeah, I'm just cornering... Ah! Yo, I have zombie in my face now. Uh, attractions in Germany worth visiting. Um... Well, there's... <clears throat> Lots of stuff in Berlin, the Brandenburger Tor, the Reichstag, the Siegesäule. Uh, the Ballermann. That's in my that's Mallorca. Well, that is basically Germany. Yeah, but I... Uh. Oh, hey. <clears throat> in Bavaria, you have um, a lot of castles, like Neuschwanstein. Yeah, the, the dome in Cologne is great. Even though it kind of, I don't know, it, it frightens me whenever I get to Cologne, because... Uh, <laughs> Over the centuries, it's gotten kind of black. <laughs> it's and kind I don't of black. Know. Yeah, it kind of scares me. Uh, but Cologne is also great for the German Roman Museum. 
Yeah, the Olympic Stadium is nice as well. If you and if you uh, come to like the Ruhr area, Dortmund and stuff, um, there's the Signali Duna Park, which was once the Westfalen Stadium or Stadium, and that is a really nice place. Oh, it appears that I need my ball. Do we like Magicka? I like Magicka. I didn't. I st I'm still pondering about getting it, but then no. Do it. Well, the deal. Well, I think the Steam deal is just uh just uh, expired a while ago. I just heard that it is fun, but it's also at the same time a buggy mess. <clears throat> well, they're, they're, they're patching it almost every day, though. Well, the main thing I don't want to have, uh, I don't I don't like having is that maybe if I, if it's just that's faulty multiplayer. Mm -hmm. Like, if you can't get the uh, games together. I heard that that, that was no, they're, 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 the they're, But they're working on it, and it's improved a lot. Also, <clears throat> I'm going to wait until they finally fix that shit. Um, Riske, yeah, thanks. I, I mean, I, I've been living in Germany for 23 years now, so I should know some things at least. Okay, put ball on spike, jump. Looks like so, someone's leaving because of that fucking stupid game you're playing, by the way. Well, it, but it's ballsome. Get it? Because I don't. Yeah, I get it, but I'm not laughing as you can hear. Um, you're so un do we like waffles? Coachman, do you like waffles? Oh god, how deep does this go? Uh, I haven't actually really had real waffles. Really, huh? Well, not like these Belgian waffles, for example. I've never had any of those. Like, I only had like I had once like those things you can buy in the supermarket already done and finished. But of course, it's rather unappetizing. Uh, can I get through here? I cut off the way ball. Well, in any case, I'm I'm more of a pancake person. Um, <clears throat> oh, I like pancakes. Yeah, definitely. Uh, German people do sometimes understand some Danish because <clears throat> the language languages have a, the same origin for the most part. So they're they're kind of similar, I think. Partly, I, I can say Kergorden just fine. Okay, yeah, Ker Kergorden. Okay, yeah. I think I have a crazy idea. It's probably going to kill me, but I'm still going to do it. <clears throat> Duta Jazz wants to know if we ever had beacon. Beacon? Beacon. What the fuck is a beacon? Oh, I actually survived that. <laughs> I think it's bacon. What? Bacon? No, I've never had that. What the fuck is that? Ah, uh, gebratener Speck. Yeah, I know what bacon is. <laughs> uh, to be honest, yes, I, 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 had it, I had it twice already today. Once for breakfast one, and once uh, on my pizza today. <clears throat> So do you like it? Yes, I like bacon. I should take less of it because it's actually not that healthy. Also, yeah, I got a random yeah. secret. Yeah, I, I don't like bacon. You're probably one of those vegetarian twats. Dude, shut up, I was. <laughs> you actually were? Well, oh, yeah. For three years, yes. I want... I, 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 I You're really so like... inconsiderate, jeez. Well, the problem is... Uh, in my regular form, there are a truckload of vegetarians. Also, so even a, even a vegan. A vegan. And yeah, they, and I always get a crew like, oh, I had just had, had pudding with soy milk. Ooh, that's so great. That actually, sounds, uh tastes really good. I don't know. It's just I what? still eat soy sometimes. Well, it's just the it's just the point. What's the what's so bad about cow milk? Of course, it's made by something that something living, but still. And the same thing. What's a little bad about meat? I mean, that's the circle of life. Um, also, to, to stop that conversation about the Dutch stealing the German language, uh, they didn't steal it, just, you know, devolved from that, with lots of influences from English and French, for example, because uh, the Netherlands were occupied by all kinds of different people for most of their existence. Hey, the son of Quetzalcoatl. Quetzalcoatl was actually, wasn't this actually a real uh, Aztec? Yes, yes, it was a bird. Yes, like the bird god. I, I actually remember something like that. Probably also only because of the Age of Empires campaign. Also, when, I, when I'm drunk, by the way, it, it can happen that I start, you know, shouting, I am this and that Aztec god, give me your beer and cigarettes. Okay, good to And know. it works. <laughs> I am Aztec god, give... Sacrifice something to me. Sacrifice your beer to me. Yep, otherwise I'm gonna, yeah, something like I'm gonna... Uh, where strike is with lightning and, and, and rape your virgins or something. 
Uh, I currently have the problem that I'm ballless and there are a truckload of, truckload of zombies running after me. Nope. Or just taunting at me. <laughs> well, the game looks really uninteresting. At this point, it seems pretty nice, yeah. It's just a little bit bland, I would say, but I think it's. Yeah, like, like the enemies are always the same. It looks like you're playing Painkiller. It's like also the same. What's the and you're bunny hopping. I think I actually do move faster. Yeah, as I said, it's like Painkiller for the most part. Oh, it's just that I don't just can't blast everything I'm, that there is. Oh, I need to. Where the fuck is my ball? Okay, I should actually. I, the problem is I'm currently like aggroing even more and more enemies, which is kind of uh, counterproductive. Well, whip out the shotgun and shoot him. Right, I'm close to my ball. I should be close okay. to my ball. Where the fuck is my ball? <laughs> it is like pain, because I'm just bunny hopping around them. Yeah, so I told you. Ah. Conveyor belt. Painkiller, another game I never played. I've actually I started playing it, but it started crashing after a while. Oh god. I think I'm kind of cornered now. Oh, wait, I have a, I have a cube. Ah! Oh god. I have, I have like small problems. Oh god. Yeah. I think like... I should have my ball by now, but I don't have it. Ow, 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 ow. Ah, uh, hi. Let me just hammer you in the face. Mm, what's the worst Aztecs can do? I'm gonna say human sacrifice. Oh, our favorite five games, Coach Ma. <laughs> Gothic. And again, it is actually one of my five favorite games. Uh, Bioshock is also on the list, certainly. Mm hmm. Go on. Uh, then, few. Super Mario World? <laughs> well, it's like one of these games which are just good, but I wouldn't like consider it as a best game ever. I don't like it. Okay, this is kind of annoying. I think I really should have my ball here because there are too many enemies. Okay, I'm just going to the... Okay, kill me, guys. <laughs> Thank you. So you've got... You named two games. Bioshock... Not sure if I should... Oh, there we go. There I have my ball. I don't know if I should name The Witcher because it actually has a really tedious beginning. I've never played it. Uh, Risen is certainly not on the list. It is a nice game, but it's more like a reassurance, and not like an actual game, if that makes mm. any sense to you. No, it does. It's just like, yeah, we still know what you want, guys, so just keep on waiting, we're actually cranking out the game. And what you want? Hmm, Borderlands? No. No, <laughs> never. Bo um, Borderlands just got too boring after a while. And also someone wants you to do Mountain Blade. <laughs> oh god. Uh, he's I've, got the game, he's got Mountain Blade, I made him buy it. And I've even tried to like play that story campaign for a bit, but then I got... I don't play the campaign, play multiplayer. I played the multiplayer ones for you, and it was rather... Uh, it's a problem that I play multiplayer games mainly also to like shine or, or just grief the fuck out of people, and with 64 uh -huh. people on the server, it's not really gonna happen because nobody's noticing you. Like, no. Yeah, yeah, there's like one... Guy who's doing nothing already. But the great thing about Warband is if you just say, hey, is anyone from Serbia? Oh, they will just go crazy. Why? Oh, uh, yeah. Because, Ser yeah, because Serbia, Serbia, Serbia is... doesn't exist anymore. Or? Yeah, no, no it does, but people ah. that uh, are not part of Serbia anymore, they will, you know, they would just go raging all over the place. Well, I think. And you can strip yourself naked and just ride around on your horse, uh, throwing javelins at people. That makes him mad as well, for the most part. Well, I know that Warbound is actually in core a good game, but it's just a game I can't really do anything with. Or just mm. nothing that I... <clears throat> that's not yeah. that's not my style of games, man. It's a lot better if you mod it. Um, okay, so my fa favorite game... Oh, yeah. My favorite games... Also, uh, best game, I would also say Fallen New Vegas. Just adding that to the list. Yeah, I can't say that because it's not because it's made with the game Bryo Engine. <laughs> so that's like eighty points off <laughs> of the rating. Um, <clears throat> okay, my five favorite games: um, Monkey Island Two. <laughs> it's the best adventure game ever made. Then there's Man of War: Assault Squad, the best strategy game ever made, or real-time tactics, I should say, because it doesn't have base building. <clears throat> then there's uh, Rome Total War, another strategy game. Pretty old, but still awesome. Uh, Baldur's Gate is not one of my favorite games. It, it's 
good, but it's not one of my favorites. Um, that's three so far, isn't it? Um, also, I would, uh, as five time, I would probably add Age of Empires 2 to my list because I wasted so much time with this game. Oh yeah. Um, I would, I would love to say Napoleon Total War, but uh, I don't know. Since the last patch half a year ago, I can't play it anymore. It just will refuse to start, and I've tried at least forty different things to fix it. Um, Empire was a disappointment. I think Battlefield Bad Company too. Was that that good? It's it's really good. It's a lot of fun. Um. That's four. Come on, guy. Uh, Come get up. Uh, Red Dead Redemption would be number five. Yeah, I actually still want to play that game, but it's probably never going to be released on thing on PC. Yeah, it's not. But on the, on the PlayStation, it's amazing. Oh, I'm sorry. And and the multi the multiplayer is a lot of fun too. I almost wanted to, I almost want to say I'm sorry, uh, Mr. Fancy Pants. I can't afford consoles, but I basically could. But I just don't want to. <laughs> I know. I know. I, I don't know, I didn't buy it myself for it. I was like, there was some money left that, and, and, because my parents apparently got some money back from something, and I'm gonna go into the details. Um, and they just said, well, you, you know, we, we don't wanna have it, so you have 300 euros. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna get a console. <laughs> so I basically never lost the money because I never had it. To begin with, okay. Oh, if I would, I wouldn't mind if I would get a console as well. It's just that I, I already have the PC, and that's fully enough for as a gaming platform for me. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. Ah. Uh, um. Replace a Battlefield but Company Two with FIFA Eleven. <laughs> no. <that's laughs> yes. A football game. A football game. Yes. Um. I love. I like it. I really like it. Um. I'm getting old, dude. It's like. They're like two more games. Um, that I want the only two other games I want to get this year are Gran Turismo 5 and FIFA 12 when they come out I'm getting old there are also not that many games I'm really looking forward to like I said Skyrim is a game which I could potentially buy but I like I said I'm, all these promises they make I take with a sp ha uh, spoon with loads of uh, how do you say uh, taking some, something with salt or salt of grain ah yeah salt of grain or in my, in my case it would be a whole salt mountain but, um, yeah, FIFA 11 with, uh, people, I'm not talking online, just, uh, like, just friends you can go to, it is a lot of fun, especially when you do tournaments and stuff. Uh, favorite game genre would be strategy games, real-time strategy. Preferably without base building, because it's just, I uh, know. So, I assume, then again, StarCraft had little amount of base building, didn't it? StarCraft 1 was fun. Starcraft 2 was probably not. Considering, no. Considering how we started that sentence. Yeah, pretty much. Um, Dude, Jazz wants you to make the next stream earlier. Uh, not gonna happen. Or... Yeah, I mean, it's, it's. He started at 8 p.m. Um, that's like prime time for GMT plus one. Basically. I mean, we've got a guy from Michigan watching, or we had a guy from Michigan watching. That's like. It was like five or four an hour ago for him. PM, that is. StarCraft 2. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like that game. It's basically, hey, I'm gonna make 50 of the same guys and then just gotta, you know, click them somewhere and they're all gonna die and then, yeah, that's StarCraft 2. And I'm gonna build a wall with buildings. Oh, yeah, there's that an, not wall. There was that one guy again. Was that guy's chucking fireballs at me? Mecha Sonic from Minnesota is watching as well. And some of Montreal. I love Canada. Oh no, how should I possibly avoid those fireballs? Oh, and the, the guy from um, Michigan is still here. Okay, I should stop. <coughs> 4, 4 p.m., so it was about I right. Should stop I should stop grieving that fireball chucking guy. I'm sure he's getting frustrated after a while. Stop sidestepping slightly. That's unfair. Oh, there's a second guy. And those douches actually realized the only weakness of my ball by standing on a fucking pedestal. <laughs> so many people from the USA. Um, Coach, do you, do you celebrate Easter? Uh, not really. Let's get my fam- we- Okay, did this Easter- Well, you're off in Switzerland, well, so. this, this Easter not, but we usually all, always colored egg and did this egg-ditching thing. 
actually know what I'm talking about. I don't know how, how this tradition is uh, is used. Or, you know, where you just uh, like ditch X on each other and see which one breaks? Uh, no, I've never heard of that tradition. Not? No. <laughs> actually... You use Swiss people are weird. You call the eggs and then you just ditch them on top of each other to see which ones. Uh... I mean, you you dip stuff in hot cheese. <laughs> we also dip fruits in chocolate. That's the... yeah, that is disgusting. No, that's uh, that's actually quite delicious. I actually had that once, and it's yeah, of course it's decadent as hell because you have like a yes. spring fountain of chocolate, but still. Jeez. Ever since the British War in the 14th century, the Swiss people have gotten decadent. Also, I just realized that I drowned these uh, pillar guys. Well, uh, to, by the way, to anyone, I have not been baptized. I'm not uh, in any kind of religion. Uh, I've had an atheist upbringing, so. You non-believer, you! I should punish you because I am. Well, I'm. I'm not. That, for which religion? For which god are you punishing me? Uh, Christians or. Yeah, I'm not a Christian, or so you, you would be discriminating against my uh, religion by doing that. Or because I, you know, I'm not a Christian. No, wait, I'm, how do I? Protestant, or I don't know how you would say that in Protestant? English. Protestant, yeah. I'm not a Protestant. I don't have any, I don't have a confession, so. Well, I am a Protestant, so I am, of course, punishing you in my so beliefs, know, which I don't really all believe. About, all about money, because you're a Protestant. I'm still not, okay, let me see. Connect the ball to the raft, I... Oh, uh, ah, Con connect the ball to the raft. Oh, hey, he was actually going. Yeah, there's a ball connector. Okay. Someone was making that Psychic Weekly magazine joke again. Slightly what? Yeah. <laughs> Something was like Psy Psychic Weekly magazine, then I unsubscribed, but they never saw it coming. Ah, no, I see. Uh, I have to drain the water again first. Reese Cake, we. Don't have to be Christian to get buried or married, uh, but for but we are, if we want to marry in the church, it, I don't think it matters. Like I, I've never been too, you know, too concerned with marriage. Just have to go. Because I'd only do it for the tax uh, benefits. That's so. That's so egoistic. Oh, it didn't. Come well, but well, not just for me, but for the wife as well. Huh. Right, it didn't connect <clears throat> the ball. Yeah, we are pretty lucky to live in a secular state. <clears throat> I don't know about Tojman though, he lives in Switzerland. Those guys are pretty Christian, I think. Uh, also Catholic. Yeah. But that's what you get for living on a mountain. It's, it's not like I really care, care about beliefs to begin with. What the f- oh, ah, now I see it. I have to drag it around while the water is still down. Now I get it. Ah, get it. press the button again. Thank you. <clears throat> okay, you have to be Christian in Denmark to get buried. I wouldn't worry about that because like getting burned is a lot better anyway, because you don't waste any space. Uh, you mean what do we call it? Cremation. Cremation, exactly. We could also spend your organs for a good cause. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm not going to do that. I'm a smoker. <laughs> Well, I don't think I don't think my lungs are worth anything. Well, I don't think my body parts are not worth anything either. That's the problem. I would do it, but people don't let me. They don't let me. They say you're not, you don't, you're not allowed to do that. So why did I do that whole thing? But you were also not allowed to join the army. Yeah, because they told me I'm too fat. But yeah, they and they told me I've, I'm. You know, I have a psychic disorder, so, or mental disorder, so I'm not allowed to either. Well, the, the problem was that I needed a whole day to figure that out, and I'm too fat for the army. <laughs> I, I felt so stupid because I made all these stupid... At least I didn't, ha didn't have to do the sports test, I'm glad about that, but I had to do, like, spy psychic tests, uh, view tests, etc., <clears> and then in the end I just say, you know, you're just too fat. Yeah, well, I was lucky. I just wrote him a letter saying, oh, I've got, I'm diagnosed by a doctor that I'm a schizophrenic psych... They've got a schizophrenic psychosis. Jeez. Um, okay, now I get so to do I to... didn't even have to go anywhere. I need to crack that inside. Oh, I like this question. Coach Jones, did you ever have a girlfriend? Uh. Either of us. 
<laughs> Did you have a girlfriend, Swart? I'm not sure. It's not like I had know. like six or seven. I'm, um, I, I'm living with one. Like actually in the same apartment. Oh, for like so one and a half years now. So. So she could actually be viewing our stream now. She made coffee a little bit earlier, Aww. and she's not viewing. She doesn't find it interesting at all. Oh, I'm not interested for it. See, that's the problem. So you can already know what, what my answer is if I have a girlfriend or not. No, girlfriends don't care about me, it seems. Or girlfriends. Women. Women. Those things Gorgeous. with boobies and such. Boobies. <laughs> uh, I think I'm slowly drowning. No, I'm not. Okay, so I raised the water even higher. And yeah, yeah just. I did. No, I didn't have any girlfriends at all yet. What about the money you earn, you know? <laughs> yeah, what what am I supposed to do? Buy like a huge ass pimp suit and. I hear there's salmon in Russia. <laughs> Great. <laughs> of course. I don't. It's not like I want to buy a lot. Jeez. What do you expect? What for a horrible human being do you expect me to be? I don't. I don't... Pretty normal human being. Yeah, and normal human beings buy a lot. Oh, someone made a joke about balls again. Well, this was about time. Wow, you're still on the road, eh, Coach? Well, I, I was currently just thinking about what the hell am I supposed to do currently. Ugh. Okay, now I have to raft all the way up there. Is there any... I just don't see why I have... Su what's the use of having such a high... Uh, high water current or water surface. <clears throat> I don't know, man. The game is so boring. It isn't. It looks it's, it's like trying, but your failure isn't as funny. <laughs> well, there are barely any enemies. Let's see if I can actually swim outside and see if ah, this is okay. Another question for me. Okay, yeah, I'm wanking in my free time usually. Um, I'm trapped. Studying, yes, history and philosophy. So there. Hmm. Look. Oh, I think I might know what I need to do. No wait, I don't. There's a switch over there. I'd like to find an open gate. Let me see. Wait, there's a help button. Why not? Turn the ball right, right around in front of the edge. In the middle of the room, disconnect the ball. Place the ball on top of the raft. Okay. And then what? Activate the player button. Room, raise the water to up the ledge. Roll the ball from the raft into the corridor. And pull. Ah, fuck. Then. Okay, the help system is kind of stupid. Someone asks what the game is about. It's about balls. Yeah, pretty much. It's like a between, mix between puzzles and uh, ball connecting. Or ball from, you know? I wouldn't want to play it because it, it doesn't have enough cocks for me. Someone sent me a Skype message because I'm not playing games with them right now. Please. Oh, your SA goons, eh? You're cool. Yeah, my SA goons, and we make lots of dick jokes, and we we stalk people, and we're generally being jerks to people that are not from SA. You are, you stalked people? What? Well, there's a guy, uh, the, another goon though. He's um, he he he's kind of weird. Uh, <laughs> Lord he, he wrote fan fiction about uh, Tenchi Muyo. <laughs> and connected it with Final Fantasy 7 and it's really bad. He created a Red Bender, as in the, the Bender from Futurama, and called him Nerdbot, which is also a Steam name. So he's really easy to look up on Google. Ah, Nerdbot, I actually heard about that. Also, I can actually ah. drown, I just realized that. And the problem is the water doesn't, uh, the thing doesn't regenerate. That's actually kind of mean. Okay. Oh. Um, but yeah, he's, he's a really pathetic guy and we just I just like creeping him up and asking him if I can like twist his nipples and stuff that's <laughs> quite nice of you I know didn't realize what, what a jerk you became in the meantime oh quite a jerk quite a jerk <laughs> I've got fed up with being nice to people for the most part oh as long as you I mean it's the internet it gives a fuck true Okay. It's not like it's serious business or anything. Okay, I still don't know what to do here. I'm kind of lost. Yeah, I see you. Alright, do I need to go through this room? 
Hey, does anyone know how he can get out of that room apart from closing the game? I can just drown myself. Balls, yeah, but you might want to try it with balls. Good idea. You know, if I, I'm going to back through Discord and see if there's anything of use. I might be, like, missed something. Is there, like, a path I can go? There's nothing. Okay, I'm just... Wait, no, there's nothing. Okay, I'm just going to drown myself and see where the game drops me. Secondary school? You mean, like, a university or a college or something? Tech guy? Also, uh, could you summarize uh, what the game is about for Victory Man because he just joined Coach Uh The ball is a game that combines uh, a gravity gun like uh, gravity gun like weapon with a ball, and the card of the game is to get through the level using that ball, and it's used to solve puzzles and kill enemies. Okay, now. Fascinating. Is that button actually pressable again? No. No, the problem is the button is also not pressable again because I can't. Uh, Raise the water, so I'm just going to. I like how it makes out uh, hurting sounds even for me to drowning. Oh, I see where I need to go. Uh, Fuck! Uh, <laughs> now that I'm almost drowned, I actually see where I need to swim. With 18 health left. There we go, I can swim underneath here. And Juta wants to know if you will play until you finish the game. I'll probably play through it. I've, it's not that too long game. I know if I would, it's an indie game. It's exactly. If I, I know if I would, <laughs> it would be quicker if I would stop being retarded, of course. Like, obviously missing that I can swim on. Dude, I've, I've seen you play Trine. <laughs> I've played Trine actually fairly competently. Yeah. Uh, you should have seen me playing Amnesia. That was terrible. The I bet. I've n I haven't seen a competent run through of Amnesia yet. Yeah, well, the problem is that most people play it blind, and it actually it doesn't have like two hard puzzles, but they just. It's the, one of those puzzles. These kind of puzzles which just make you are simple, but make you look really stupid if you don't figure it out at the, on the spot. Mm. Like I said, one puzzle was like I said, where I failed to count Roman numbers. It's like that you have like levers which either go for one Roman number and or another Roman number. It's just two rows, and with a lever you could choose which number you take, and both rows have to sum up uh, sum, sum up to nine. So I promise I thought I got it right, but I actually miscounted one row, and I constantly didn't realize that because I constantly miscounted. Okay. That's the, that was. The <laughs> Stop dodging, jeez. Um. Okay. Is someone man on crack, which is the best username I've ever seen? I'm being serious. Um. I'm not. I'm not bisexual. At least I don't know if I am. I've never tried. Um. Yeah, Man on Crack asks what your who your guest commentators for trying were. Uh, uh what? As a what? What people all or just uh, yeah? Let's see. We started with you, Swabot. Uh huh. Then there was Soapy. Soapy no. Which was. Oh yeah. Uh. What's he doing nowadays? Like, he's like the sidekick for Grawl and Moro and Dopey. Uh yeah. Also, let's play forums, of course. Then there was, uh, what should we call it? Uh, Freezing Inferno, Zabizu Kamesu, um... Oh, uh, she's still alive? Well, she started an LP like ages ago, and I think he, she didn't continue it. Huh. And there was also, uh, who else? Luigi Fan, and of course... Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I remember Luigi Fan. Yeah, I, oh man, I remember when we played Left 4 Dead, and I heard a... Uh, a girl's voice in the background. I was like, uh, said something about uh, penetration and and her, and then it turned out it was this like two year old daughter or something. Yep. <laughs> I felt so bad. Oh, you should feel bad. And of course, yeah, also, I know. I, mean, I didn't know it. So. How could I? F oh yeah, Rancho, of course. And how could I forget the bastard? Yep. <laughs> Good old bastard. Let's see. Okay, I still don't know. So I have to like go for one room, go in an empty pool, activate the buttons in the lower pillar. Because apparently I'm much nicer than you. <laughs> well, they don't know you yet. They don't know me enough. I was about I only, to I only seem nicer because I can pay attention to the chat because I'm not playing a game right now. Yeah. Also, you, you just you sound nice. It's, it's like the wolf in uh, the sheep fur or sheep pelt or sheepskin. Or you mean the big red wolf? Yeah. You know, like the. There's, isn't there like a... Uh, Red Riding Hood, for example. 
Yeah, there's like a, a saying like that goes like that. You know, that just describes a person that seems nice, but in in real, for real, he's actually a huge ass douchebag. Well, mm. not that I, not that I'm implying that you are a huge ass <laughs> douchebag. I would never do that. Then I also wouldn't sit with you in a Skype call for like two hours now. Oh yeah. Mm hmm. And and I told uh, some friends of mine like two hours, three hours ago that I would join them in an hour to play games. And now you're sitting here. Yeah, but well, fuck them. Jeez, they're goons. Solve free present desire to lower the central pillar once the pillar is done. Well, I still need to know where the last puzzle location is. Jeez. Well, I think I actually found the last pu puzzle location. I can get my ball over here. There we go. Good ball! Who's a good ball? Okay. I'm amazed that I haven't done this joke yet. What do, oh, what do we hope or think we're doing in a year? I think the same, right? Uh, yeah. That's like one of these questions I can never answer because I don't... Uh, I'm one of these silly people who never, like, try to plan anything. No. I'm still gonna do the same, like, history and philosophy at universities. <laughs> you will ever... you will always be studying. Well, it takes like six or seven years, dude. To study something which you probably will never get any decent work for. <laughs> In the end, you will still like. I don't know. Ah, uh, you you are probably you probably have a different definition of decent work. Ah oh, wait. Ah, oh, there we go. Now I can get up here. We. And there are two touchy things. I touch that. I mean, are you still doing the same thing you did two years ago? Uh no. Or one year ago, I guess. Uh, yes, I'm just, it's just been a year since I'm employed at my new workplace. Then, a year before, I was, I was probably still in a, no, I was workless. Mm. <clears throat> yeah, I think it was the whole puzzle. And, yeah, another year ago, I was still, I probably just finished my apprenticeship. Yeah, I think I remember it like that. Oh, there we go. I, f I think I've finally done with this level. Just ending that plate. Ah, oh, great. No more green. Well, there's probably going to be another water level or something. I still, oh. would, I still would like, a hot time. Like, I like to have like some, some sort of boss or so. Then again, yep. the screenshots boasted something like that with like undead gorilla guy and <laughs> lizard. And, and a dinosaur, yeah. Or just... Didn't look more, look more like regular lizard people, but then again... It's not like I can... Oh, lizard people are quite... whatever. Also, real god apparently had a birthday yesterday. He became 22 years old. Happy birthday, I guess. You're now a real man. How old are you, Coach? You're 21, right? I'm 21, yes. And he's older than you. Apparently. And you're saying, he, and you think you have the right to say he's now a real man? Well, it's you know that the age age. The age age is relative. Like from what I've seen so far, I'm pretty much the oldest guy here. Oh, you're a big boy. I'm 23. <laughs> I see you come out uh, there, maybe, maybe be like a I don't know, 40 year old housewife or so coming now and say, "Yeah, I'm the oldest one." I don't know why oh, I I'm think that. Older. So there we go. Okay, another easy... Oh, yeah. How old did he say? Mr. Tech Guy is 15. I should probably make less dick jokes then. Well, he's the one doing the most dick jokes. Are you... I am really supposed to jump over these. Oh, wait, there's a... And Man on Crack is 14, and he, he calls himself Man on Crack instead of Boiled Crack. Dude, but like, at the age of 14, you should not do crack. Just saying. Uh, well, my ball is now gone. Great. And there's still spikes. Great. I just lost my ball. Oh, hey. That door opened. Beautiful. Ooh. Also, now that we're talking about 14 years and 15 years, I remember in Red Dead Redemption multiplayer, I just joined a posse of some dudes. Um, and we just, you know, decided to ride around, kill some banners, and we just came across another posse of dudes. We started shooting them, and then, like, 11-year-old kids started screaming at us over the voice chat. <laughs> it was amazing. We, we, we couldn't stop doing it. All right. But yeah, yeah, that's how I play games, First by the person. way. Hey, I actually see footprints if I jump on something. See? Pang. Footprints. Completely pointless, because I don't know how I'm doing those. Anyways. 
Yeah, I know that symbol. Isn't that like Team Fortress symbol thing? Yeah, symbol it, it, it is. The, that's what I thought too. That's the Team Fortress symbol. Oh god, and that was almost lava. That's another game I don't like anymore. Uh, to be perfectly honest, I don't. I don't really like it anymore either. Yeah, finally someone admits it. Well, the, did you actually see what crap they released recently? Uh, the claymore was enough. <laughs> to be honest. Oof, that was close. I, di I didn't like the claymore shit. They released such a ridiculous amount of stuff. It's not even funny anymore. And it's just uh, they all they started to do like promotion packs where they do like uh, release uh, items specifically like for if you buy a game. Like if you buy the potato sack, you got a potato hat. Mm. If you buy it, ho if you bought home fra front, you got like a specific item. There was Shogun Two. If you bought that, you got like chocolate of items. There was like a huge. It's, its own item set, basically. Also, yeah, exploding but... balls. I think... Like, the update... The last update that I enjoyed was uh, the Scout update with the Sandman. The Sandman was kind of silly, though. It was, but I think it had its uses, and it wasn't completely ridiculous. Uh, I think it was a little bit over over the top at the, at the release, because... I, what else did Drawback? You couldn't double jump anymore, but that's it. Yep. Well, it, it is a rather huge drawback, but the problem is that the stun was so ridiculously stupid. It uh, <clears throat> made the game pretty unbalanced. Yeah, but I, I don't know, I just preferred everybody looking the same and there only being like one or two uh, different weapon loadouts for, for all the different classes. It, it made it a lot more tactical and less just random. Mm. I don't like randomness in my shooters. Well, then there's the problem that Team Fortress 2 still has critical hits. Yeah. Yeah, that's... that's all... Uh, that's math. That's different. Well, what, what is math? That, that there are crits in the game? Criticals, yeah, the chances of scoring a critical hit. Well, then, yeah, they did change it after a while that, that you... that it's... that you... it's more skill to do a critical than actually luck. It's like there's a co coefficient that, uh, you have, like, five... two percent of base crit chance and if you mm. the more damage you do the higher the crit chance becomes or something like that but it's bugs in your screen again yeah Could you... <laughs> thank you thank you for exploding ball I don't know what's the gimmick of those things up to this oh hi that guy was sleeping and now he's rather angry at me whoa hey he actually dodged it now he just stood now he just stood in front of me okay do you like serious Sam I actually played. Question by Juta Jazz again. I actually played. I actually bought the Serious Sam package when it was like 90% 90% off, and after this, and I played through the first game, and I have to say, single player is a little bit bullshit, but in multiplayer it seems to be like a decent game. I played like a little bit of a uh, cold multiplayer and it was actually pretty fun. Ah, good old cold. Uh, the multiplayer was really, uh, uh, single player was really obnoxious because it's. The later levels were basically like it just spawns and spawns more and more and more enemies and it was just Jesus Christ, just stop it. It's like you were stuck in an area like for ten minutes just because the game kept spawning shit. Mm. And it was yeah. the problem is it wasn't even challenging, it was just uh delaying you the whole time. Yeah. Uh I think serious time is ridiculous and it's, I'm not interested in it. Okay, we've got two more questions. Um, okay, the one is directed at me by Torn. Um, I don't know if I will be attending Gamescom this year. Um, I, I, I missed it last year, but I might go this year because... I mean, it's still in Cologne, right? So why not? Because NO 2070... Oh, oh, uh, right. Uh, if <laughs> Six favorite games, one of them being NO 1404. Yeah. NO 1404? Is an amazing game. Well, isn't that if it's that one? I think is it one of is it one of the older ones? No, it's uh, the newest one. Oh, okay, because I remember a really old one that was frustrating as all fucking. Hell. Yeah, sixteen oh two probably. Uh, let me actually quickly see. Uh, it is. Um, I just have my shelf. I can't read it because it's too dark. I think it's sixteen oh two. Yeah, that's the oldest one. Okay. Also, another question: What do we? Uh, no, how do how? Did we come to know each other? Was it before LP? 
I it wasn't. No, I it wasn't. I f no, it wasn't. It was a. Uh, LPF. I lost it. Yeah, it was over LPF. It just. I think. Oh yeah, you started with the idea of LPF, and then it basically came together. Yep. Yep. LPF didn't work out, but at least we're still friends, right? <laughs> True. We had our ups and ups and downs, but we still, in the end. Yeah, yeah, you 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 threw a hissy fit because you thought I called you uncultured. <laughs> true. Which isn't true. Which isn't true, by the way. Well, it's also the problem that I. Don't... I think you also just. Oh yeah, I I think one of the main grabs is just that, or you had is because I just can can never be serious and always have to do stupid uh, jokes. Yeah, you're always ridiculing my profession. Exactly. Yeah, that's. Oh yeah, that's. <laughs> Even though basically. <laughs> All of modern culture is based on that, but that's fine. <laughs> but it doesn't matter now, anyway. Um, We're still playing with balls, and I'm activated an elevator. Coach, what is your opinion on Portal 2? It's boring. Uh, I'm not sure if they can keep the formula fresh. Portal had like a perfect length, and was it didn't get boring. It had much variety, and I think just because they throw in a random co-op mode, I don't know if it can stay fresh. Spectrum. It's Portal. Portal was boring as fuck. No, Portal, was Portal had the perfect land to stay interesting without getting boring. I fell asleep at the first level. Like, the most interesting thing was throwing stuff into the toilet <laughs> in the beginning scene. <laughs> That's what you can do, like, in Half-Life 2 as well. Whoa, my ball. You played Portal, so I don't need to play Half-Life anymore. Okay, what are our three, three favorite movies? Uh... No, I could be really silly and say Dragonheart because it's like. One... <laughs> oh! Spikes! Are you serious? It's like a childhood movie which I started watching at the very beginning. Uh, when I started watching it, I was like, haha, oh, it's dragons and such. It's just uh, kind, of, uh, kind of like adorable. But it's not really like a personal movie. I think one of my favorite movies is uh, The King's New Groove. Ah, uh, I know. <clears throat> Never heard of that, but The King's Speech might be one of my favorite movies. I haven't seen that one yet. It's it's great. You should. It's really good. You should try and watch it in English, though. Uh, I will. I I because became it's all about language. So I became uh, not enough of a new movie smog to actually uh, watch everything in English. Yep, like me. Um. Okay, so we've got The King's Speech. We've got uh, well, Pulp Fiction, obviously. I, I don't really, I don't really like Pulp Fiction that much. It's a subjective thing. Yeah, it's, it's just plain weird, basically. It is, but I like it. Um, I mentioned Watership Down earlier that I like it, but it's not one of my top three. I'm also just thinking about movies I really like. It's kind of hard to tell. Mm. Also, this boss fight is rather boring, or it's not really a boss fight at all. It's just punt punting people into the spike pit and then. Getting them, making them get spiked. Jesus Christ, just get punted. Oh, Mato SVK is leaving. From Slovakia. Well, good night. Good night. Um, they did, didn't, what? Wait, the enemies don't get killed by spikes? Uh, I, I missed. Haven't, I think I just haven't been paying attention then. Yeah, I, was, I, I missed. Ah. Um, the uh, movie. I did like it's Inception. Nah, I, I haven't seen Inception yet, by the way. Inception is likable, but it's like, you know, I think the main reason why Inception is likable is that it appears... It's because Leonardo Di DiCaprio is an amazing actor. No, I hate Leonardo DiCaprio. But uh, his only stupid movie was t Titanic. And that's why I hate it, still hate him. Yeah, but he played really awesomely in every other movie he was in. No, I think that... Oh, uh, shit. Lava. Uh, the reason why Inception is actually so people like that much is because it seems complicated, but it actually isn't. But it's like it makes the like the standard uh, idiot viewer, I just say it like that, think they actually like are into something Understand. deep. Yeah, they're understanding it. They're like into something deep. Like, oh, this is so interesting. Like, and I actually understand it. I, it's like it. They just get really motivated by this movie because they mm. think they actually understand a quite uh, complicated <laughs> movie. So it's like Final Fantasy VII, basically. Oh, I don't know Final Fantasy VII. <laughs> oh yeah, you don't like those games. Nope, um, I never played a single Final, Final Fantasy game. That's fine. Um, Where the fuck is my ball? Okay, it's all the way at the other in end. In your hands. Um, 
that movie. I, I just had it. I forgot again. Oh yeah, Meet the Feebles. Oh, that's the one with, from Fleet Attraction with those uh, Muppets, isn't it? Yep. I still haven't seen that movie. You have to. It is amazing. It's like it's actually rated uh, 18 plus in Germany, even though it's nothing but puppets. Well, then again, there's uh, the fun thing. Fun thing I actually read about this movie is that in one scene they actually they use an actual gun to kill all the puppets. What? They actually use. Uh, isn't there, there one scene where one puppet shoots others with a Tommy gun or so? Uh, not with a Tommy gun, with an. Uh, I think it's a 50 cal. Yeah, the fun fact is this is actually a, a, was a real working gun they used. So they actually awesome. destroyed the puppets in those scenes, but they could never do that like do that a second time. That scene. <laughs> uh. But it, it was a great scene. Uh, Man on crack the. Puppets fucking, puppets shooting each other, puppets doing drugs. That's why it's for adults. So you probably have to wait a couple of years before you can watch it. <laughs> you know that he won't. That he won't do that. So what? Am I... Of course not. I mean, I watched it the first time when I was like sixteen. I think I forgot to press one switch. Where's my ball again? But yeah, why do we hate JRPGs? I mean, I played all the Final Fantasy games except for thirteen and fourteen. Uh, why I hate them? Yeah. Uh, I just just like. Uh, turn-based combat. Yeah, I hate grinding. Yeah, and grinding as well. That's what I. It's just a problem that I I need to like have more than an impact in a fight than just selecting the attack and that's it. Mm. Because uh, like for example, in Paper Mario, Paper Mario has actually, has actually like this nice feature that you can like dodge attacks and make criticals and make chain combos by pressing. Well, it is rather uh, rather simple, but still, it, it worked. I had have, like, have, like, to press a button at the right time to do more damage or block enemy attacks. I, I like turn-based strategy games. <laughs> and even better was it was it actually in a Mario and Luigi Partners in Time where you can actually like uh, completely dodge attacks by just pressing uh, by trying to avoid projectiles. Made some fights ridiculously easy though, but still. Uh, why do I still need... I pressed both of those switches. switches. Uh, someone... Duta Jazz obviously has a question. Uh, what do we think if we hear the word bang? The third wall is special. What First is... word that comes to mind when you hear bang. On its own. Oh, I see it. Oh, you're getting a hint again. Yeah, I didn't know where... The problem is I don't see where the third switch was, so I actually had to, like, cheat and look up where I need to go, because I need to... Uh, give the ball momentum so I can actually like roll it up a ramp. Mm. Uh, but I hear the word bang. I yes, bang. I actually think of the movie Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, which I've never seen, which I've never heard. Yeah, I I think of Gang Bang. But that's just me. Oh, I don't. Uh, okay, someone's friend defines RPGs by having turn-based combat. I think that guy needs help. I don't know, what was what RPGs in turn-based combat? Uh, like, like Torn mentions that a friend of his defines RPGs by having turn-based combat, which oh. means Gothic is not an RPG to him. <laughs> Where you actually, well, it's a problem that you actually have to do things in this game, it's like select attack. Yep. Menu or simulator. Again, and again, I also don't really like RPGs where, like like I said, Dragon Age and Everton Islands, where you just uh, select they just choose and don't really have an impact on the combat itself, it's just except choosing skills and such. Yeah. Uh, also, Man Craig asks if you're going to be streaming in an hour still. Uh, I'm not sure, it's just how, depending on when I get sick of this game, considering how, how view, actually, actually a lot of viewers left, so I guess yep. not that much anymore. Especially I think it's because of the game, for the most part. Like, a lot of people said, oh, this game is boring, I'm going to leave. And I would join them, but I don't even have to pay attention to it, so it's <laughs> fine. You are my secretary, jeez. And I mean, I'm doing exciting stuff, I just... Oh, what's, our, what, what's our opinion of Twilight, by the way? <laughs> I've never seen it, like, I don't have an opinion. It was on TV a couple of weeks ago, and like I, I ignored it for the most part, but then I, while zapping, I saw it, and I just saw some oh, of course. teenagers... Mm. Playing baseball and jump around like Superman, and I was like, "Oh my god, what the fuck!" 
and then I switched away. Well, I, don't, I don't like Twilight, I don't know. I, I'm <clears throat> never gonna bother watching it or reading it, because I think it's just some gay bullshit. What about your girlfriend? She doesn't like it either. <laughs> I, pro I expected that. Oh, hey, my ball is just rolling down. Wow. And RuneScape, oh my god. I sound like a valley girl again, but still. RuneScape, oh my god. <laughs> uh, so grody. I've played it like for one hour. I remember that uh, my friend taught me into taught me into playing that. I was like one hour kill. He was like, I wanted to attack goblins, and he said, "No, no, no! You're way too weak. You have to kill like one billion chickens, chickens before." Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, come on, it's, you aren't serious. It's like the same thing when I played Silk Road and bashed on killed those living haystacks for I don't know how long. Hmm. I mean, I shouldn't complain about RuneScape too much because I I played Ultima Online when it was still cool, um, and it was really cool. But like RuneScape, never really. I don't know. It looks, it looks grody, and it's I don't ah, I I can't play it. I can't enjoy it. Let's say like. Let me see how far I actually am. Place where I'll start till till two. Okay. Yeah, and you can get to level one hundred and sixteen. <laughs> Okay, so, so I have one, two, three, four levels. Oh, only four levels left? Jeez. That's an indie game. One, two, three, four. Okay, I did four levels and now there are four to go. So I guess I'm actually going to call the uh, stream quits, uh, quits for now. Okay. If that's okay with everyone else. I still want to finish that game because I'm think I think it's going to get more interesting later. I mean, there are still the lizard people and... Uh, Lizard people and that undamped monkey, uh, not, not giraffe, Mon uh, gorilla, there we go. Mount gorilla. Um, also, Pokemon. I play Pokemon Blue. I play too much. And that's it. I play too much Pokemon. I played the first two generations and then I realized what bullshit it was. It's boring as fuck. I actually like the first, I actually like the, the fir first and second generations. First just got silly as hell. Mm. That's where it seriously started to, uh, seriously started to, like, uh, I don't know, lose it. Well, what do you want me to play? That's the question. Yeah. So, uh, what's, what's the plan anyway? Um, I think I'm just going to call it quits at this point. I could play some Su Super Meat Boy, but I think streaming that is a, it's already obnoxious enough of, uh, playing it regularly. Yeah. Um... I don't know, if people want to, like, next time you stream, I can join. <laughs> well, yeah, it's actually the question if people want more, uh, want more guest commentary or not. Because it was now just more based on random, random rambling. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure that's better than you saying, oh, I've got my ball, <laughs> for three hours. <laughs> yeah. Well, but ball-related jokes are funny. Yeah, people stopped making ball-related jokes an hour after you started. Well, because I was busy being in a call. I don't oh, yeah. do it anymore. Uh, no, I'm actually going to uh, quit the stream. I'm not going to do anything more. Um, because the problem is, if I need want to do another game, I would have to set up, set it up, and that's tedious. Yeah, I know. Uh, the next stream will be probably in a week again, because then again, isn't next week the whole Easter stuff like fry, uh, car Friday? <laughs> How is it called? <laughs> How is it called in English? It's starting to call Car Friday because it doesn't have to do anything with cars. Yeah, I don't. I don't care about Easter. Like uh, Easter, Easter Saturday, I think I have a con conference for a movie that we're gonna make. So. Well, it's um. The thing is that I um, I have days off on, on these days. That's why. I, that's why I actually care about it. Ah, okay. Well, I'll 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 announce the streaming time again. Like maybe even uh, earlier than like. Uh, I was it like five hours before I actually start to stream. Maybe I actually do it like a, a day, whole day before I start or whatever. We'll see. Anyways, uh, yeah, thank you for guesting, Swalbot. Aww, uh, you're welcome. Aww. I love you. <laughs> uh, yeah. I love your Wiener too. But you don't love my ball, it seems. Well, it's just one. Where's the fun in that? Anyways, okay. I wish you a very good night, everyone. Good night.